Hello, hi, is this thing on? Okay, I think everything is good to go. Welcome in everyone. Hi, happy Friday. I hope everyone's doing well. I hope that you've made it through the week primarily unscathed. Oh my God, you have such a good name. Un Forestero. What's up? Hi, welcome in. <laughs> Hello, Craven. Craven, you were here before you would stream even started. Dedication, Limbo, Zordon, Jen, Alejo, um, Sauce, <laughs> Koi, Nikon. Welcome in, everyone. Did I miss anyone? Hi. Um, Koi, it's been a minute. How's life? Exuid, nice to see you. Welcome in. Sorry, I was tinkering with a lot of things before stream started. Button! Button, Brian Kim. Button. Thank you, Exit. <laughs> Thank you so much for the 25 months. I appreciate it. Thank you for all the support. I hope you're doing okay. Run first tomorrow. Yo, Jazz, have a great time. Koi's a mod here. Leave. Whoa, 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 whoa. I need you to spill the tea here, Sauce. What's going on? Why do we have issues with Koi? What do I need to know? Absolutely hyped. I hope you have a fantastic time. All good. I'm I'm hanging in there today. Um oh yeah, I had to, I had to go ask my partner about how to say sauce with like a southern drawl, by the way. <laughs> Just memeing. Okay. You're awake, you're awake. Hello, Vlosk. Welcome in. Koi's a bad fish now. When has he not been a bad fish? They're selling foam swords? No, I'm definitely buying one. Hell yeah. Sword fights, let's go. I'm here to sunrise now, it's 8 a.m. Oh, I hope you're having a good morning. Um, yeah, me too, Exuit. I, I'm, I'm kind of in the same spirit as you today. I like, I'm not feeling it today. I don't know what it is, but it's just like, it's a tough, tough fat Friday, a tough morning, like no motivation. There was a part of me, it's like, I don't even know how I'm going to, be present on stream like i don't even know how to bring myself to do that um somehow i'm here magically maybe it's because i've done it for a few years so it's like okay to like actually start a stream now um and i'm like used to it i'm on autopilot but underneath it i kind of just feel like you know like big oof energy today i just kind of want to lay in bed and and not think about existing for a whole day you know just those kind of vibes um, I don't know what exactly it is, but I need, I need the spring to come, like, real soon. Uh, I need to, like, go outside and, like, live a little. <laughs> For the last few weeks, I'm sorry, Jersey. I hope you come around real soon. Uh, how's everyone else, though? Yeah, that sounds wonderful. What, to, like, th not think about existing for a while, laying in bed? I just like try to put on some videos where I get cheered up by other people who are happier in that moment. That's what I try to do. Um, I'm mostly going to be buying swords and chim on the run for to use for your Lendl night cosplay. I hope you have some really cool things that you come across. But hey, I'm still happy to be here. Um, 
There's a there's an influencer I follow that has this saying, and you know sometimes days like this you gotta kind of need to remind yourself that um, they say every bad day is a luxury because it's a luxury that we're alive. So I try to remind myself things like this, like even on our worst days, even when everything just feels like crap. Sometimes we gotta be grateful for the tiniest of things, and sometimes even if existing is a pain, sometimes existing is better than not at all. You know? Uh, so yeah, I'm trying to keep the good spirits, um, but I am very stoked for the weekend. I could use a bit of like, no lifing a little bit. Uh, I feel like all I've been doing the last few weeks is kind of taking care of life stuff and I just need to like mellow out just a tiny bit, you know? But it's taco night tonight, which is really exciting. Um, I don't know what we're, what kind of tacos we're making, but we've been like trying to come up with something new every um, Friday, Taco Friday. Just skip the whole day, you know, sauce? I would be down for that. The major stress riser was partially removed yesterday, so that I slept like a baby finally. See, it's like, it's kind of like a thorn in your side, right? Jersey is like, once you finally remove it, it's like, oh, I, now I'm no longer grumpy anymore. The Swedish tradition, yes, I do it. Hello, Gromas, what's up? Yeah, gratitude is good. A ton of uh, Dr. K from Healthy Gamers since I've been down the past few days. He has a ton of mental health tips and knowledge I found useful. That's awesome, Jess. That is really good to hear. Um, sometimes just listening to people talk about these things really just helps you like get through a lot of it. Um, but like today was like, I don't really, really even know if there's anything I'm going through. It just like I woke up and there was like a mental fog, you know? Like it's just it's just looming over like when you get a bad weather day. It's just hanging around. You're in the gym right now? Just PB in the Sith machine? Bench press? Yo! Which, what's, what's your PB, Koi? Congrats, that's awesome. Hey, son, happy Friday, pirate. Good morning. Uh, go elsewhere at Fair Jersey. I'm hyped for Dragon's Dogma 2. I'll play it after work. Yo, have a good time with it. Enjoy it. I had a lot of fun with it yesterday. That made me try to separate my logical brain and my monkey brain and try to reconcile them every time we feel down. You, you get there, Jazz. There's some good advice there. Hi, Gorka. Be sure to take care of you. Number one priority has to be oneself. I, I'll do my best, Gorka. Sometimes stepping away from the problem is the best thing that you can do because it helps you cheer up. So hanging out with all of you is a good day to me. Mental on cooldown, yep. Mm -hmm. You put 55 kilograms on, no idea how much is the machine's own resistance. I find that, like, I don't know what kind of machine, Smith machine you have, but I sometimes find stickers on the inside of the machines, and, like, mine would tell me how many kilograms is the actual resistance. But unless you don't have the actual stickers on there, maybe, like, looking it up if there's a brand name on it on Google so you can, like, at least know. I know that the one I in my gym is, like, either 7 or 10. It's 11.3? Oh, okay. Nice. You be Radon? Nice. Heck yeah, Jazz. I have been getting Souls cravings recently. Even though I'm playing Dark Souls, I, I mean like just outside of the realm of speedrun. Hello, Nella. Welcome in. Hell yeah, Koi. Look at you, getting so strong. I, I could use some, like, you know, every time I go to the gym, um, I feel like really happy after I come out of it. I feel like I need that kind of energy today. Time to replay Elden Ring or the Dark DS3 DS3 Arch Thrones mod. That would be pretty cool too. But like go back through like Bloodborne. All the others. Mm -hmm. So welcome in everyone. I don't know what you plans you have for the weekend, um, but I hope they're good ones. I hope you have something to look forward to. Uh, today we're gonna be doing some more Final Fantasy VII. I kind of changed up the schedule a little bit because we did our Dragon's Dogma stream yesterday and I wasn't sure if I was feeling ready for some Dark Souls runs today, so I'm going to practice this weekend. Um, so next week runs are um, hopefully smooth and they go well and we actually get a PB. So I figured I would take the time to do some Final Fantasy 7 today, um, which means three Final Fantasy streams, 7 streams this week. Pretty lucky for anyone that's been hoping that we do some more. Jim is your happy place for sure. Yay. It's not my happy place though when it stinks. Yeah, a lot of people saying are it has a lot of like Sekiro bosses, but I also saw a lot of DS1 bosses in the Arch Thrones mod. I'm really looking forward to Dragon Quest monsters. I need to create more monsters to make them stronger. That sounds good, Jersey. Good plans. 
And you might be able to finish the Dragon Ball Kakarot DLC too. There's some side content to do. Oh, I know what made me feel good yesterday. I got to watch the sixth episode of Invincible last night. Show's still going strong. Really enjoying it. Um, I don't know if I have any plans to watch anything this weekend or do anything in specific. I haven't really thought that far. All I know is it feels like it's been a really long week and I can't wait to just hit the weekends. Um, yeah, well, it's not... There's a second season, but right now they had a small mid-season break, so they're continuing the second season. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. It just came out last night, Jersey. Or ye yesterday, 21st, essentially. I got some cheap rescued food rice, fried fish, battered chicken, spring rolls. Today, I reheated it and added some instant Japanese curry sauce. This is improving my mood. I made... Japanese curry yesterday, Gorka, and that was like really like hit the spot. Um, maybe I'll have a little bowl of it today as well. I even like, I don't know what it was, but something about I made like a little puff pastry and something about dipping the puff pastry in the curry sauce was like really delicious. Like the crispiness of the puff pastry and the, the savoriness of the curry was really, really good. But I somehow managed to like whip that up yesterday. Um, I stopped stream and I was like, okay, I got an hour to whip up some Japanese curry. And I always make it from scratch. Like I don't buy the pre-made um, curry packets where you get the roux already made and you just need to drop in the cubes in the curry. So I, I had to like cook the chicken, cook the potatoes, the onions, the carrots, and you know, boil them, simmer them, make the, the roux that I needed for it and make some rice. Enough leftover tonight too. Oh, that sounds so good. I, I still need to have, I need to find a good Thai place in uh, Sweden so that I can like go and frequent it. But I found a really great Bangladeshi place that I've been wanting to go back to. Oh, speaking of food, you had coconut curry on Tuesday with rice. That sounds so good, Jersey. Oh, now I need some curry. Um, I saw this advertisement from Max Burgers, Max Burgers being the fast food chain in Sweden. We, we like our Max Burgers. We were not really big on the other fast food chains of the world, even though we do have some of them. Um, so they actually came up with their own variation, I believe, of the Big Mac because they like, I saw a notification on my app today and they call it, what do they call it? Because I can't, obviously can't call it a Big Mac. It's the Big Classic. That's what it is. See, it's, it's pretty much just a Big Mac, the Big Classic. Big Max? That's what I should have done, but I think it would have been so close to getting freaking bonked on the head by uh, corporate evil McD's. Um, so they probably went with Big Classic instead. The Big Max would have been a good one. Um, I think they just, yeah, they would have had a lawsuit on their hands if they got in that territory. <laughs> so uh, I want to try it out. Like I kind of want to do a field trip to like go and try out and see if I feel like, do I enjoy? This more than my childhood memories of eating a lot of Big Macs. Here in Fairland, we have Hesburger. Their signature is a layer burger, which is like a Big Mac, but it has paprika mayo. Hmm. I wonder, I wonder, let me see. They probably just use their signature original burger sauce. Um, let me see if I can find details about what is in this burger. All right. Yeah, they have their original dressing. So like, it's just cheddar cheese, their original Max Burger dressing, um, some lettuce, and onions, and um, pickles. And then the classic sesame bread though. I might honestly just want to like, I guess you'd have to have it authentic to really like give it a go between classic sesame or... Oh, they don't even let you use their Max Burger buns. Oh, huh, okay. I could technically make this at home. The nice thing about Max is they actually sell their patties um, at, the, at the supermarket. So like, if you buy their buns, if you buy their patties, and you can also buy their original dressing, you know, um, then you can pretty much whip up this entire burger at home. I think that's one of the things I appreciate about them. It's like, okay, you like their signature dressing, you can you can buy it in the store. You like their chicken nuggets, you can buy them at the store. Um, just because I think they understand that a lot of Swedish people like to eat in and not always out and people like to go grocery shopping. So it's like their way of like, oh, how do we be able get people to keep buying our stuff, but maybe not have to like go out and eat. This dressing is stored here as well. Yeah, 
Lamad, what's up? Yeah, big burger talk today. Sorry if you're craving it. It's like it's like when I watch anime and there's a scene of them eating um, burgers in the fast food store. I'm like, oh my god, I need fries and a soda like right now. <laughs> it's always like that. The term uh, Big Mac isn't a trademark in Europe anymore, as far as I know. Thanks to a lawsuit in Ireland where McDonald's tried to go after Irish fast food place Supermax and the Irish place One. That's really unprecedented. I feel like you don't normally hear of that. Like, actually the Irish place One. <laughs> That's freaking awesome. Very pretty eyeshadow today. Thank you, Lit. Push back against the big corpo. How are you doing? Happy Friday. We're just talking a little bit about food before we actually dive into some Final Fantasy. And then I have to let you know where we last left things off. I'm going to open the mod in the meantime. Just see if everything is um, updated. There's an update for 7th Heaven. Let's do the update for 7th Heaven. You're doing awful? I'm sorry, Lit. Uh, if it makes you feel any better, I'm kind of in the same space. But I don't know if I'm going through the same thing as you, but just brain just today but we're pushing through it trying to hang out with great people mm -hmm. it's big on the sustainability thing the trays in the restaurants are made of plastic recycled from their own transit boxes for food so when they're too damaged um, to keep food safe they become trays awesome that's cute I forgot to turn on the YouTube chat today. No, why is there Microsoft Visual C++ C++ operation going on for this update? All right, let's hope this doesn't force me to have to restart my computer because that would stink. Yeah, one step at a time. I mean, it's kind of all <laughs> as many steps as we can take, but yes, big agree. Years people. A lot of dumb reasons. Meet me at the clock tower, Aaron. Are you still alive? We're gonna sling some guns. We're gonna have ourselves a high noon. Thank you for the three years. I appreciate it. Thank you for all the support. <laughs> a lurk but vibe. Absolutely perfect lit. I don't know if you can hear all my system sounds go bloop. Like every two seconds. Well, this update is going on. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's me. I'm I'm the problem. <laughs> I'm letting you know now. It's not your computer. It's it's mine. Ah! <laughs> Here, I can mute the system sounds. I can buy system sounds. You checked your work PC to see what went wrong. Yeah, sometimes it really just seems like it's your computer. It's it's more triggering when it's like a Discord sound. But then I know all the time my Discord is like on Don't Disturb, but people streams, you can hear the Discord sounds and it still triggers me to be like, oh, I wonder what that is. Wait, did you hear that boop? I, I think I turned off the system sounds. You shouldn't be able to hear it. There was a boop there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You must restart your computer. No. Great. We're just gonna... You heard it? Even though I turned off the system sounds? Well, we're gonna ignore that it's telling us that we need to restart our computer. Do you all do that with like updates? It's like, you must restart your computer now. And you're like, no. I'll restart it when I want. And I just like avoid it. They've been coming through. Sorry, Kemsuk. I added a new emote the other day, but for whatever reason, I renamed it, but it didn't rename on like 7TV. So now every time someone types O, you just get this freaking hamster with like the biggest eyes. Um, let me go fix that. Although it's kind of funny that everyone just posts a hamster with beady eyes, but. Oh. Hi, Luca. Any more O's in chat? Ah! Crap, that's my keyboard. I'm, I'm sending it back in for repair. It has one too many keystrokes on some buttons. Uh, 
Uh, we're we gonna call it Hamo. Hamo. Ah! Sorry. I'm I'm like basically putting this emote in all the. Why is it Ham? Oh. Rename. Thank you. Now you have it, but it's not going to be every time you type in O. That's the only, like, negative part about having seven TVs. Like, people put emotes on there that could be called, like, yay, and what, and how, and tree. And then, like, literally every time you type, you get an emote instead of an actual word. And it's like, oh, you have to remember that that one's actually, oh. Decrypt the message. Da -da. How you doing, cat? So you just see the text? I think it's probably just an FFC update. Probably be good to go. Okay, cool. Speaking of updates, our 7TV update is complete. So, hopefully, with us avoiding a restart, we should be able to jump into the game. Uh, someone else everyone has what is an emote thing, which if you uh, have noticed, I do capitalize properly, which means that if I ask a question, I get emoted. <laughs> yep. I, I try not to. Like, I try to remove it from being a common, like, English word that it's just going to replace it with an emote. But that just means, like, it's not going to have standardized names um, for you to be able to easily find, but it's okay. Okay. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready to game. I'm ready for some good vibes. Um, let's run this game. Hi, Lore. Thank you for the luck. I appreciate it. Do I have things like that? Do I have hello? Hi. I don't think so. You can learn Swedish. That's one way to go about it. Um, a tiny bit exit. it. So last time on Final Fantasy VII, uh, we got to explore more of Mount Corel. And... After farming for 30,000 gil, we made it to the Gold Saucer, bought our life ticket for the Gold Saucer, um, spent all that money very quickly to then lose the remaining little bit that I had on gambling <laughs> and chocobo roses. I went broke near instantaneously. I do have Greg, and that's the only one that I guess I kept that way because I thought it was kind of cute that this little platypus comes up every time we say to Greg. I think he's okay with it. Hi, it's Slash. So yeah, um, we went broke instantly, then we were imprisoned. We got to find out more about Barrett's backstory and Dine as we made our way out of the prison, out of the desert, and on our way to Gung... Gaga? Where we started to dive into potentially Zack's storyline. And I don't know what this implies for my knowledge of Zack, but Cloud has no idea who Zack is, um, but Aerith and Tifa do. Me? Gungaga, exactly. It's a bit loud? Okay. I thought you just wanted to bask in the nostalgia. Hi, Polaris. Change on hinge to you, that would be very representative of you. Ta -ta. Is that better? We good on music audio? Uh, so yeah, we're in Gongaga. Um, and I think we're gonna just explore the world today and possibly head back to the gold saucer because I think we earned enough money to do some more gambling. 
Because uh, I believe we only like touched a few things in Gold Saucer in terms of gambling. And uh, that fun got stripped away very quickly as we went broke. So that's today's plan. Bask in nostalgia with me. Oh boy, gambling. We gonna gamble. We also got our a vehicle. We got a little buggy that helps us traverse the world. Sorry, I need to restart the music. Because I connected my controller too late. Too bad, you're gonna have to listen to it again. Good stuff. Alright. Time to continue. Where is our save at? 23 hours and 37 minutes. How have we put 23 hours and 37 minutes already? Gungaga area. I think the last thing that we did... I have to maybe check my inventory for this. Is... Did we go to the reactor? Let me see. We had to quit or save because I made a mistake. We might not have gone to the reactor. Either way, we can go again. Hi, gorilla. I might have not had a chance to go to the reactor yet because I activated this like unique interaction with Tifa and Aerith in the village, and then when I left, that interaction was gone. Yes, share. Because that's exactly what I'm doing right now. Um, and these freaking dinosaur tanks. Still weird me out. This is not emulated, Munson. This is the Steam version of the game. Yeah, with mods. You played um, remakes uh, recently and definitely was not as impressed as I would hope it be. So it was your first experience with remake or did you replay remake? Maybe this is the exact thing I needed for my mood today. Ooh, nice. Cloud landing is deathless. I think trying to pad out Midgard to a 30 hour game, you know, there's a lot of people that feel that way. You're not the only one, 8-bit. A lot of people had the same sort of feel, but they were also happy that a lot of things like seeing a lot of OG elements just brought to life in a different way and the music and stuff made people emotional and nostalgic in other areas. Like, for example, like that Aerith scene with her wearing the dress is so beautiful. Like, I'm glad that we have that, you know? So we already came to the reactor. Okay, this is already done then. We saved after the reactor then. Like, I appreciate that part so much. We wouldn't have gotten that otherwise. But I un completely understand how it doesn't feel like the OG, but I don't like to think that it's trying to replace it. That was a miss that time. How do you feel about it as a stream game, though? Like, maybe it's not something that you enjoy playing, but would you enjoy watching it? Because there's a big community of people that love watching people play Final Fantasy VII Remake. Just because it's like, kind of a fun stream experience. Oh, these misses. Brutal. Let's, uh... Cure the party. We've got to give it our all. Annoyingly fast, huh?
Especially rebirths and improvements. Yeah. There definitely was that gorilla. How are you doing, Vitalis? Hey, GM. Um, you know what's the usual weather forecast for Midgar? Cloudy. Oh my god. Yeah, like, I think that's the part I also like Zordon. Like, there's just more, like... How do you all feel about the, um... More screen time for, like, Avalanche members? Like, getting to know Jesse a little better. Oh, not these frogs again. Dude, the way they dance and move is just so good. But I hate fighting them. I'll put you on ice. I'll put you on ice. Generally really like them, that's good. How did you like, uh, did you get to see the Hell House? 8-bit? I was playing on normal difficulty, bosses were dying too fast for it to change its dynamic, which apparently scales enemies based on their combat performance. Ooh. They turned Jesse from a side character into an 8 10 babe. True, true. The heiress is a lot cleaner. God, at least you're in the woods, so the heiress is a lot cleaner. I think so. We can yeah, enter the house true. to see. Hey! Ever heard of a soldier called Zack? Hey! To think. He has what kind of son? Hmm. That's weird. But I didn't save over it. Interesting. Hold on. We'll boot it up again. I don't remember saving. I remember quitting. So that would be really weird if I actually did save. And if so, then we might have just missed interaction there. Should be the previous slot? I mean, that's if I... That's if I... That's how I did my saves. Oh, you're right. Seven minutes. All right, no, no. We're good. Never mind. With one elemental material. Yeah, uh, it's uh I was very surprised at what the hell houses after. actually were in this game. Okay, there we go. Now we get this dialogue. Travelers? Uh, the one before it, Gorilla? Are you in soldier? You are, aren't you? Then maybe you know our son. His name is Zack. It's been close to ten years now since he left for some city, saying that he didn't want to live in the country anymore. He said he was going to join Soldier and just took off. You ever heard of him? Hmm. Nope. Sorry. Hi, Alex. Welcome in. Happy Friday. Young lady, do you know him? He wrote to us six or seven years ago, saying he had a girlfriend. Could that have been you? It can't be. Zack, soldier. Okay, there we go. What's with those two? Cloud, you nincompoop. Blockhead. Hey, dude, welcome in. Happy Friday. Um, my grievances with Remake had to be the combat system and the AI uh, of your companions, in the sense of that. You had to like basically switch to your companions to build up their ATP faster and get them to do things because it took them so long to actually build it up themselves. So I would like constantly be like, oh my God, I need Aerith to cast this, but like her ATP is like not building up fast enough. So I would like switch to her and blah, 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 do a lot of actions so I can cast something and then go back to like Cloud, for example. So there was a lot of like that. The AI is just not smart and snappy enough that it makes you feel like you have to wait forever for them to do stuff. Um, that was one of my issues with the combat, even though I liked it, uh... 
All right, let's talk. Let's talk to the two before we really dive into other houses. Aerith. Sorry about that. It's just I had no idea Zach grew up in this village. Somebody you know? I told you, remember? The first guy I really liked. Mm. Zack. Soldier, first class. The same as you, Cloud. Strange. There aren't that many who make first class, and I've never heard of him. That's, That's all right. It was a long time ago. I'm just worried because he disappeared. Disappeared? Must be five years ago now. He went on a mission and never came back. Zack is a real ladies' man. He probably met somebody else. Oh, poor Aerith, thinking that... Hey, what's wrong? He just left her. What a slimy... I'd be worried too, I guess. It's okay. But he should at least contact his parents. Let's go, Cloud. Unpopular opinion, I think the devs intended there to be a lot of character switching intentionally made non-controlled characters ATV build slow. I mean, I can see that they wanted it to be like that, but sometimes you're just not, like, used to swapping so often that you kind of forget. And then it's like, oh, that AI system just doesn't progress fast enough. A ATB really quickly? Okay. Zach. You know him? N no No idea! Yeah, You don't Tifa? sound so sure. She sounds very flustered. It's the truth! I don't! Yeah, okay. It just reminded me of you, that's all. Leaving the village, saying, I'm joining Soldier. There must have been loads of guys who said the same thing back then. And to think out of all of those, you made it. I really respect you for that. I just got lucky. Yeah, I worked real hard. Paid off in the end, huh? I'm so proud of you. Thanks for caring about me, Cloud. Hey, Dan. Like, if they introduced different kind of, like, combat systems, it could have been there was a good variety for players. The reactor. Many of our people caught up in it and lost their lives. It's been a while since A little bit, day, Marius, a little bit. But you can still see the scars Welcome left in. all over the village. <sighs> Do you need anything? It, honestly, Not in a really. good way, Dan, in my opinion. Like, I think, I think the, the mod has a lot of charm to it. We sell weapons. What can I do? Alright, I know I bought some things here last time. I, or I contemplated buying things. I could buy stuff. But I also want to go gambling. Can we go gambling then buy stuff? Do you need anything? I want to stay. Not, Not really. Oh, X potion. I think that's my first X potion. I have never played Postal Duke, no. A white M phone? Looks like a weapon. Do you not see a description for it? This hey, is Ian. Gonkaga. We lost many of our people when a Mako reactor exploded. That's it? That's all there is to Gungaga? It's just this small? Oh, is it uh, catchy? Okay. Tifa's a haste, first strike, ATB assist, ATB staggered, everyone steadfast block. Really reduces the need to switch characters and remake. That was cool, son. Yeah, well, glad you have some time. 
I hope you're doing really well, Ian. Yeah, and all I got was this t-shirt. Yep, that kind of energy. That sucks. Hmm. Okay, nothing really interesting here. Can I do it on self? I guess now it's just useless. It's just gonna stand still. I feel like last time I changed out my loadout with like a few things and I, I can't remember what it is we did. Probably we'll like figure it out as we play the game, but unfortunate. That's nice, Ed. I appreciate that. I, I can't wait to check out Rebirth myself. Is the HD graphics a higher FPS part of the mod too? Yes, yes. Actually, I really wanted to make a command about that. Let's see, what are we gonna do? Where are we at the map? Let's just go back to Gold Saucer, I think. It's a buggy. Driving in style. This one's for you. Nice. I got a war dog. Let's see if we can find out more information about this war dog. Uses berserk on all opponents. Okay. I have played like maybe 10 hours of Final Fantasy IX, but um, I stopped that playthrough because I was going through a lot of tough things in that period and. Kind of anything I was doing on stream just took a pause during that period, but I would love to go back to it after I finish 7. Like for it to be like the next Final Fantasy that we do. But it might be 8 depending on some other elements. Ooh, frog song. Does that work on the Joker? Well, look at you. Put him to sleep. Nice. Frog song is so helpful. Whoa, Aerith smacked hard with that staff. Yeah, pretty much, Ian. <laughs> Six of ten, I consider the glory days of Final Fantasy, except for maybe eight, which is a bit divisive. All worth playing, in my opinion. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna enjoy all of them. Play it wrong. How do you play eight wrong? the death blow. Oh, the miss. I was just trying to go for the death blow off the bat. Let's see if we can get it so we don't have to put it to sleep. Miss again. 
I shouldn't even be surprised. Just a regular attack now. Diamond? What does Diamond do? Give me money? I don't think I've seen Diamond. Does it give me money or does it take money? Or is it just a card that deals like a flashy effect? Huh, I can't tell. Okay, so it has this weird combat system where enemies level up based on the average of your party, so leveling makes the game harder. Oh, that's interesting. I play Final Fantasy VIII with no encounters enabled, and it was a much better experience. Level scaling in eight is really not an issue we would like to play in the future, though. Hmm. Played normally, it's fine, all right. It gives money. Driving this thing is not easy. Get it, put it asleep. I'm so glad that missed. That was so close to being dangerous. Yeah, I've heard about junctions. I'm gonna have to become familiar with the system. I think that one will probably be my uh, hardest Final Fantasy yet. All right, let's save here. To gold saucer yay let's see how much money i lose this time we gotta like check let's see what's our starting kill here before we go into this Gil. Okay, mark that number, chat. 40,000 gil. Was it Wonder Chocobo I started off with? I haven't seen this tiny Chocobo before. At the Wonder Square and play all day. Really? I don't know about that. I've more like lost gil and got no GP whatsoever. Okay, first things first. We have to perfect basketball. the basketball game. Then... Okay, that was too long of a press. Already starting off great. I need to hold it for shorter. Too little. Back, Too much. Hmm. Back, I feel like it's so hard to get the right timing. Back, Here we go. No! Back, We talked about this, and everyone says it's like Gil for gold and not Jill. Like Jill Valentine. But say it however you want. Oh my god. There's snow in between! Back, 
Oh my god, strike! Yes, I am! Hello, welcome in! Oh my god, this is gonna be bad. No! It's like Joel, got it. Right, that's it. Nope. You think the 60 FPS is borking it? Oh, that might be right, actually. I wouldn't be surprised, because it's frame perfect now. Oh! Oh! No! One GP. No! Goodbye, money. No! I'm just lying in the pockets of the wealthy. No! To kill up? The house always wins, right? Wait, wait, how much money do you think we have now? Crap! Vision. I bet I can't get two super dunks in a row. This is so hard. Two in a row. I'm not on a roll. I, I can do this. I can do this. I can't do this. Oh, that was too long. How much gold do I have now? Okay, it's okay, it's okay. We only have 35. That's fine, it's fine. We can go for like another 5k. I don't think I've seen Cactor in this game yet. Come on. It's it's a sixty FPS, I know it. It has to be. How is that too long of a press? Do you think this will be easier if I turn off the FPS chat? Hey, Bosmas! It's so hard! Like, that was too little. Do arm wrestling? Is there arm wrestling? <laughs> More like losing money, Boswas. I'm losing it all. I can't play this freaking game! Like, there's just like, I'm holding it. 
And, and it's like... Heck this game! I got like... Like maybe three Jill out of this. Armor must have this much GP. Do you want to exchange your GP for a prize? Not a yes. <laughs> nope. I think I broke because like, I was too close to the AI there. You have this much GP. Do you want to exchange your? No, nope. I want to play arm wrestling. Mega Sumo arm wrestling. Want to go? That's cheaper. Please like the opponent. Wrestler Su Sumo. Okay. Ready? Go! You what? It has to be the frames. No. Mega Sumo. Not. There's, the there's no way. Wrestler. Ready? Go! You there's no way! There's no way! I'm playing on hard mode. Rest. Ready? Go. You. This is some like extreme European Metal Gear Solid smashing right here. <sighs> yeah, no kidding. Faster. <laughs> I'm the. Everything is harder with 60 FPS. I can't do anything. Come on, get it. I have to literally How leave the gold saucer. Oh, <gasps> so that I can reduce the FPS. This? It's here in the middle of Moogle Forest on the top of Mount Moogle that we find Mog's house. Another day in the life of Mog is about to begin. Yay! This year, Mog is Koopy Popopupo years old. That's 28 in human years. He's at the age when male Moogle desire a bride. This is a game. In the Moogle Kingdom, males are considered perfect candidates for marriage once they learn how to fly. But Mog still has to learn how to fly. 28 years and still has to learn how to fly. He tries ever so hard each and every day. Dear, it's not looking good, is it? Here's where you come in. Help Mog learn how to fly by pressing confirm to feed him his favorite food, the Koopo Nut. But take care not to overfeed him. He won't be able to fly if he's too heavy. Don't want it? I don't know what is the right amount of coupon nut. Where does this end? He's ready to fly. I think he's ready to fly. But why, what do I do now? Oh, what's this? It seems Mog has decided to take another shot at it. Drum roll. Dear, it didn't work this time either. What? Poor Mog will have to wait a while longer for a bride. What the heck is Continue? this game? What is this game? How? I can stop feeding him. I 
I think I heard the sound effects. I guess I just need to wait. I didn't know what to do with the game though. I didn't realize I just had to wait. Hi Amber, happy Friday. See, now he sounds special. Same thing happened last time. I didn't realize I could just stop. Let me so. I guess I just didn't realize that something was about to happen if I just waited. Oh, what's this? It seems Mog has decided to take another shot at it. Da drum roll. He's flying! Oh, he's doing Mog has it. finally done it! He's become a fine and upstanding young Moogle! Amazing. Am I gonna get one GP for this? Da, 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 da. He's ready to get married! Tired but relieved, our little Moogle turns the lights out early and goes to bed. <laughs> Good night! Yeah, they and have sweet the easiest dreams. lives! What do you mean you just go to bed a second after you fly? Well, well! What do we have here? He's gonna miss out. A female Moogle! Too busy sleeping? Wait, what? Is she just helping herself? He seems to like her! Does she, he need to demonstrate the flying? Will what kind Mog of courting ritual is this? In front of her? Help him steal the show with a few Kubo nuts? Hey, Karmic! What easy life. She's waiting. She's waiting! Look at her. Look at her intently waiting for this Moogle. To show off his prowess, his flying skills. To be the Giga Chat of all Moogles. Come on! You're keeping her waiting! Oh? What's this? It seems Mog has decided to take another shot at it. Giga Mog. That's it, she's into him now. That easy, just fly for all the girls. <laughs> As you can see, her heart's been stolen by Mog's assertive flying. Sort of flying? flying? <laughs> Sometime later... His what? <laughs> the happy couple are getting along like a house on fire. Time for a quiet date in the forest. That's one expression. Her name is Mag. She's an incredibly good-natured Moogle. Like a house on fire? Dude, we're like the wingman to this Moogle. Best of luck to the both of you, Mog and Mag. May you have lots and lots of healthy Moogles. Ah! What the f- It is a freaking Pikachu right there. What? How much have they been- what have they been doing in there? Dude, that mushroom cat must have been shaken. Days. Oh my! No worries there then! Is <laughs> all those nuts he ate? Favorite nut. It was so touching. Thanks for sharing such a lovely story with me. Seriously? I got 30 GP for playing that? That was so touching. No way. That's a lot of GP. 
Man, I'm bo- Wait, can I try this? Can I try the submarine? Because I showed him the game, not even he could beat it. I always That's right, because so I'm the gamer around this. here. Too hard. This is too hard. I can tell already. mean. I don't like this one. It's really hard to like balance your speed ups and catching up to these enemies. zone so they like can't like get close but okay you think 60 fps is not good for this game either is it making it too hard so like what gives you the score points the less the car gets hit Wait, I didn't win anything? I just gotta play a game? Or you just have to make sure it gets doesn't get hit at all. Don't you dare! They hit it. I think they hit it. I want kiss donkey. I think we're struggling a little bit with it. It's both those riders. Nope.
Da, 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 da. I got 10,000! Where did you come from? Nice! Okay, 10,000 plus gives 10 GP. Cool, I did it. Hey, Vitor, welcome in. Yeah, definitely Marius. Very interesting Moogle rituals there. Obtain speed source. Wait, we gotta do that again. We gotta do better. We gotta do better. We can do better. We can set a better score. Well, I don't know if you can go and play the Moog game again. The mod game again, I mean. Get a single one here. This is so much worse than last time. Like I'm I'm losing points. I think you get points, like, not getting hit, and then, like, you can lose them when it gets hit, yeah. I don't know if me hitting it counts as a hit as well. That truck suffered a lot. The boxing game? I don't think I've seen a boxing game just yet. Okay, we'll try one more time. One more time. One more time. Alright, here we go. At least the music is good. really bad. Like, I'm not able to get exactly where I need to be. Are they so good at, like, speeding ahead all of a sudden? Stop bullying my car! 
Well, there goes all the 5,000 points. This is really hard. Dude, getting 11,900 seems really impossible now. How did I get that? I don't understand. How did I get 11,900? Hey, dude, dog, what's up? Sleep is for the weak? I don't know. I don't believe in that principle. Whoever tells you you sleep when you're dead is not very wise in my mind. Sleep is so good. Sleep. Enjoy it. Feels good to sleep. Okay. Stop these journalists getting to Princess Diana. Wow, that's dark. <laughs> okay, let's see what else we got. So the arm wrestling is apparently a meme at 60 FPS. And we'll work a couple more hours because you get overtime, right, Shervik? Wait. This is for the weak? You're right, they did spell it as the weak rather than a E A K. True. This place really burns a hole in your pocket. No kidding. I think we should try the basketball one game again one more time. Where do I find other games? This is such a scam, though. It's okay, we can put a little bit more. It's okay, it's okay, we'll win big, we'll win big, we'll win big. We'll win big! I- Oh, we got a potion! I wonder if you can get anything more than a potion. GP? Not bad. I actually got more than the potion. Honestly, at this rate, we should do the math. It's been like four losses. Okay, that was GP run. I need a Gamba emo? I do. Let's give me some GP. A potion! Okay, okay. We didn't lose. I mean, it's the most overpriced potion I've ever seen in my entire life. But I didn't lose all my money. See, potions are generally 50 gil. Paying 100 gil for a potion is a ripoff. Dang! Now I'm getting all the potions. Oh. There's a mega elixir? That's like the fourth time we didn't catch anything. Okay, okay, we can put another hundred gold in here. There is also 80 and 100 GP. How much do you think you have to, we have to gamble to get that one? Should we do it? No, there isn't? I'll put one more in. Heck! I'm still mad at this machine. Ah! I need a, a robot to do this for me. Like, I time it to, like, press the button for exactly this many seconds. We're thinking that 60 FPS is making this harder for me, Vitor.
Oh, I got two. Yeah, Only. I thought maybe I could get a third shot. Heck! Ah! Wait. Okay. Ah. We can't even do arm wrestling. Because it's too hard. Wait. Was there anything here? <laughs> I finally- Wow. Phew. I finally won something. Jeez, I want to win something. Let me win something. Oh, I don't think I've been here before. Would you like to hear the rules of this attraction? This is the shooting coaster. The ride goes zoom, you go bang bang, things go pew pew, and then you destroy them with a big boom. Pretty simple, huh? To shoot, hit this button here. The bar on the left side of your screen is your power meter. When it's full, it'll go bam. When it's empty, it'll just go pish and putter out. So keep an eye on it. The person at the counter will keep a record of your top three scores. Good luck. That made no this sense whatsoever. This attraction costs 10 GP. No! Change my- What do you mean I need to use my hard-earned GP to play this game? Hell no. Would you like to- What are the top scores? Oh. Zero. You'll receive a prize if you score more than 3,000 points. So buckle up. I bet it's a stupid prize. I need to, like, go somewhere else. Yeah, yeah, I, I'll come back, but I need to make some GP first. Um, what's a fence square? There's nothing here. And round square? No. I've already messed this one up. It's not the ghost square. Bow square? Chocobo square. Wait, have we went to the bow square yet? Are you here for some battles too? I like fighters, but I've got no time for the ones who are all tall. I like... The story happened? Is there anything else that happens here other than the story? <gasps> that crap. Still not enough. Hmm. You're new here, aren't you? Why How's you know? About the battle arena? Do I look like a battle in the arena newbie? Here, you fight tooth and nail for battle points, which can be exchanged for goodies. The place is one big fighting game. Except your life is on the line. Sign me up. To enter, I'm enjoying it a lot, Dan. The front desk there. You can fight up to eight battles in a row. Of course, the more you win, the more battle points you'll receive. Thing is, if you lose just one battle, you'll also lose all the points you've earned. Each time you win, you decide whether to carry on fighting or not. Handicaps are dished out as well to make things even harder. The arena decides the handicap, so you won't know what you're stuck with until right before the battle starts. Last but not least, if you leave this area, your battle points will be wiped clean, so be careful. Oh, and the maximum number of points you can accumulate is 65,000. You can't have any more than that. If you ever get that many points, be sure to exchange them for something. It's like the fight tower in Hunter Hunter. Welcome! You currently have this many battle points! Thanks! Come back when you're stronger. I wouldn't want to kill you before you save the world. <laughs> How do you know I'm going to save the world? Alright, I think I'll have another stab at it. I reckon I could have gone a bit further. It's so hard to know when to stop. Okay. Dio's showroom. Ooh. What's this place? She says mask. Is 
so hard to interact with stuff, though. Okay. Let's talk to the lady at the counter. Hey, have you heard? Something awful happened. Shinra's soldiers were shot at, along with some of the staff. No kidding, it happened All right here. All the soldiers here. died, but it looks like the staff got lucky. Only minor injuries. Okay. Since you've come all this way to the Gold Saucer, I recommend that you visit Dio Show at least once. Dio, as you probably know, is the esteemed manager of the park. Register for battle? The entrance fee is 10 GP. Okay, never mind. We're gonna have to come back for the sh like the shooting game in this one. Because it actually requires GP. So we're gonna go to Chocobo. Yeah, it's a me. I don't know why I try to do that in the Mario voice. Instead of freaking Jojo. Wait. Okay, here we go. Welcome! Are you the registry? Which rank? Alright! Thank you! Rank B! Here we go! Will be starting soon. Let's make some money, everyone. All right, number one, Mike, 100 kilometers. We have another one, Robber, here. Number four, also 100 kilometers. Number five, Arl, at 98 kilometers. So we got one, four, and five. Um, so, four, five. So four, five would be the next one. Okay, so who are our characters? Their names are Mike, Robert, and Arl. Alright. Mike, Robert, and Arl. Here we go. Okay, alright. Uh, Arl's in the lead. Arl's in the lead. Robert all the way in fourth. Um, Mike in first. Okay, this is good. Looking good for Arl. Keep it up, Arl. Keep it up, Arl. In first place, dominating all the Chocobos. Oh my god, Robert's catching up in third place. Oh, and falling all the way back into fourth. Arl's taking, still taking the lead. Arl has been a winner Chocobo in many races. <gasps> okay. Uh, Robert just moved into third place. Um, Mike in, in third. Oh! Arl fell off all the way to fourth. Oh no! No, 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 this is not happening. Okay, wait, hold on. We still have some contenders. We are um, uh, Robert. Robert's in second place. Um, Mike is somehow now... No, wait. Arl is in first place. I'm so confused. Who's who again? Robert's fourth? Robert's fourth. Okay, Robert's fourth. Mike is in second. Um, where the heck is Arl? Arl's in last place. Heck in last place. Oh no, back in the last place. None of them are taking the lead. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Never mind, we have a change. Um, Mike, Mike is taking the first place. Keep it up, Mike. Let's go. Let's go, Mike. You can do it. Look at our little Chocobo go. We at least have a chance that. Robber here might make it to second, but Mike wins. Okay, so, okay, two of our Chocobos actually made it in the first three spots. Nice. So Mike wins, followed by Robber then. How long does the song go for? Mike? I thought Mike was first. Yeah, see, Mike was first. Robber was fourth. What did we get? Firefang. Okay. I lost. How'd you lose? Wait, why would we lose? Why is he lost? Welcome. Do I have to have two of them win in the first place? And how do you win? Yeah. The registration fee is... No, yep. Which rank would you like to bet in? You bet on the first two past officials, so it has to be two. One bet. So you Thank mean you. Mike actually... The will be starting soon. ...failed us? Heck. Mike and Robert failed us? Do we have a bird named Sean? Sean in number three. And we got Knight in five. Look at that name. And then we got Leah in six. 
But what if you wanted to make a combination? What if I said I wanted to do like five six? What makes you choose one five and one six versus five six? This is just a gamble at this point. Like that that part I don't know. So I'm betting on Chocobo's one uh, three five and six. Five means Chocobo's number one through five will come first and second in some order. Oh, I see. Oh, I didn't know that. So if you want number six, you go with three. And number three, you go three, six. What if I want number six? And then number three. Or are they all valid combinations? Or if I did one, six, and three, six. And five, six. But wait, we have no number one. Now that's confusing. Okay. Why would we bet on three? Well, we can bet on five and six. Okay. All right. Our Chocoa names are. Sean, Sean the pink bird, Knight the purple bird, and Leah the white one. Okay. Sean, Knight, and Leah. Let's win. <laughs> Leah's in first place. Uh, Sean is somewhere in fourth place, coming up into second place. Okay, we got Sean here. Um, we got a bet on. Oh, all of our companions right now are in top three places. Sean, Leah, Knight. Oh, no. Knight fell almost to last place and last place. Straight back and forth between random enemies. And now they've taken the lead, all three of them. But can they keep the stamina up? I do not know. Um, Sean, Sean's fallen. <laughs> oh my god, they're so close. Like, Leah's taking the lead, and literally everyone else is just fighting for their lives. Just clutching. All right, we just need Leah to stay in the lead. Leah, stay in the lead. Please, please, please. Sean, no, Knight, Knight, keep it up. Don't lose your pace. Don't let them overtake you. Knight's already falling. No, 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 Knight. I need you to get in second place, Knight, and stop acting up. Oh, no. Leah's lost all momentum. She's falling. She's slipping. No, with this random chocobo in green has totally taken the lead. We can't have this. Leah has overtaken them. She's in first place again. Knight has taken first place. That's okay with me. Don't worry, Nia. Leah, Leah, get up there. Oh, my God. Stop. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I need my one or sixes here. I, okay, I need my one or my... What the heck are you doing? What are you all doing? No, we bet on three, five, and six. What am I talking about? Heck one. Okay, we got... Yes! Our two chocobos in the lead! Yeah! Leah got spent early game. So first and second must be one, five, one, six, or three, six. I lost? I thought I won. I don't get it. I still I'm don't lost. get it. I still don't get Welcome. it. The register. Which rank would? Thank you. The next rank. I still don't get it. If Chocobo 2 has the best endurance, Chocobo 4 is the fastest, Chocobo 5 is good at both. Now you can distribute them, the bets. 2, 4, 4, 5, and 2, 5. You can bet for first and second place. Okay. 
So if I want Chocobo 2 and 4 to be in fastest, I have to put 2-4 as my first bets? Okay. And then what... So if you... Is there an order to this? Like, let's say if I put 1-4, is that my first pick? Or is it any one of the three picks? So let's say if I put 1, 4, 1, 5, or 1, 6, if any of these combinations come in first, then I win. So Chocobo 1 first, then Chocobo 4, or Chocobo 1 and Chocobo 5, Chocobo 1 and Chocobo 6. Does that make sense? Is that what it is? Any one of those three. Okay, I see. That makes more sense. Okay, 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 cool. Let's see uh, our Chocobos here. Hi, Greg, welcome in. We're just, uh... Getting really caught up with gambling here. So, George is fast. And so is... Rika, number three. So that's six and three. But George has more stamina. So let's say four, six is one of them. Who's gonna be our next one? Hi, Mana! The playthrough goes really well. Having a good time. So we bet for 77. Now we have 274, so we have to choose between them. Nancy. Which is number one. So what if we bet... One... One six. No, wait. One three. Why would 3-6 would be good? Wait, hold on. Oh, you're right. I don't know why I chose that. You're right. I don't know why I chose 4. I just messed them up. Now I want to bet on... 3? I would bet on 3. What about 3 and 6? No, okay, we already did that. And we bet on one. What about one and six? Okay. I think I understand. All right, let's do this. Okay, okay, I, th I think we got this. I think we got this in the bag. All right, all right, all right. Wait, 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 we bet on one, three, and six? Okay, that's all we care about. Three's the lead. One's in last, six is in the middle, that's okay. At least was not spending itself early. Three still in the lead. We have no idea if they're gonna lose. Look how fast they're running. They're wasting all their stamina. Look at that, they're charging ahead. What are you doing? Okay, that's okay. That we get gives us one some time to catch up. One and six have time to catch up. One and six have time to catch up. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We want this. We want this to happen. One's in fourth place. Six is in fifth place. I would want to ride a chocobo all day too. Hi, Evelyn, nice to see you. Thank you for the 33. It's like Lisa, or I don't know whoever the number three is, is kind of getting spent now. And four is like kind of trying to overtake. So we need one and six to perform. Yeah, definitely all blown out stamina wise. Oh my god. Okay, one's catching up, one's catching up. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. We still got this. We still got this. One's in second place, one's in second place. All right, we just need these two to dominate. I need six to catch up, six to catch up. Six, catch up, come on, 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 you can do it, you can do it. Okay, okay, in fifth place, we can do it, we can do it. Overtake, overtake to fourth. Overtake to fourth, overtake to fourth. Come on, one, 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 I need you to catch up. You're lagging behind, we're not gonna win like this. Come on, one. Oh my God, two is taking the lead. This is not looking good for us. One all the way in fourth place now, no. Okay, three, three, we need six. We need one or six, move ahead. We're not gonna win. Oh my god. Oh! Oh! Wait, why is two in the lead? One, six! I need performance now! Give it your all! Okay, okay, one, one's in the second place, one's in the next place. Six, I need to catch up. No! Who the heck was two? So it doesn't matter what order they come in as long as there's a variation of those numbers. If it's one, two, or two, one. What the heck were the stats of two? Dang. 
Sarah? Who the heck was Sarah? It was also the Mega Elixir. I lost. Welcome! The registration fee is... Which rank would you like... B. Thank you! The next race will be start... Dario? Ooh, Graham. Graham looks promising. Number two looks promising. Sarah looks... But look at Dan. He also has good stamina. Ooh. This 2-4 ticket looks good. Alright. But Sam just has stamina. Edward. Edward is good balance. We do like Edward. Four and six? Look at six. 96 kilometers, but still has good stamina. Who is two? Two had... We can also bet on, like... Edward and Graham. Two six. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna go for. Okay. We have a now? No way. We are not reliving these memories, Radio. Absolutely not. Who do we bet on? Two four six? Alright, okay, okay. Force in the lead. God, do not spend all your energy all at once. Okay, we got two. We got four in first place. We got two in third place. We got six in fifth place, but it's okay. Six will come back. Six will come back. Fourth is still in the lead. This is why I always get scared when there's a huge lead on, like, the first one we bet on. Like, look at this. This might fail. We need two and six to take over. We find them. We found the minigames. Yes, Singu. I've lost all my money. Okay, two, four, six, two, four, six. Fourth and f fourth is in first place. Six is in s second place. Now in third. Um, where is two? All the way in the back. Okay, two needs to catch up through this weird water segment. What are we playing? Mario Kart here? Okay, four and two. Four and six. We got this. We're gonna we're gonna get this. We're gonna get this. Six is taking over four. Four is falling behind very quickly. Two is trying to catch up. Trying to get in the second place. Trying to secure that bag. One coming out of nowhere. We don't want you here. One, get the hell out. Two is taking first place. Six is taking first place. Uh, four is in fourth place. I need to catch up four. Okay, six and two, six and two, six and two. Take the lead. Please take the lead. Please take the win. No, no, no. Don't let these scumbags. Don't let these scumbags in. I don't know who the hell one and five are. I don't know what they're thinking, but they are not going to win. Come on. No, 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 no. Come on. One and two. Who the hell are these folks? Okay, four. Four, four is in second place. Two. I need to catch up. Two. I need to catch up. Six is in first place. Okay, good, 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 good. Four, two, four, two. Catch up now. 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 Come on! Step on it! Yes! One has exhausted themselves! Alright, six and two, six and two, six and two, six and two, six and two. Go, 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 go! Cross that finish line! Four! Look at four with a burst of speed! All of my numbers! One, two, four, and six! And that's how we win! <laughs> Please give me something good. I got ice crystal. I don't know if an ice crystal is good, but I won. I won. Yeah. You may exchange your ticket for an item or GP. I'd like the GP. Your item ticket is worth this much GP. Is that okay? Yeah. Cashed in 50 GP. All right, Welcome. we're going again. We're going again. We're going again. Explain, yeah. The registration. No way. Which rank? Thank you. Here we go. The next. Mm, all right. Bet on your birds, chat. Which is your bird? Let's see. Oh, young looking promising. Okay, we're gonna bookmark two. We're gonna bookmark two. Hmm. Peter. Peter's not looking bad. Peter's looking okay. Let's see. I like I like the prospect of two and five. Okay. You think four? That is some okay stamina. They might hold out. I have been putting a stamina bird in my mix as well. 
Like, they would be better than Harvey. What's the highest stamina we got? 320, then 313. Yeah, I think 4 is, is looking like a sure bet as well. 2 4. Then 6. I think we can make a. 5 6 combo. What do we think? Going Poyo Poyo flashbacks? Arl and Peter? Alright, is that Arl? Ooh. We do have Peter in the mix, though. That's four chocobos? Oh, I didn't realize that was four chocobos. Why did I put six in there? No, I meant... I meant two and five? No, five and two? No, we already have that. Four. Four. Okay, that's what I meant. Four and six. Two, four, five. No, wait. Why do I keep putting more birds in? Who the heck is six? This is getting really confusing math-wise. It's four, five. Okay, sorry. My math's going all out the window. You know what I mean. Okay, this is this is our four birds. Four, five. Let's just make sure. Peter. And... Why Dan, though? No. No? No. Wait. It was Peter. It's definitely Peter. Peter and Young. Two and five. But we already have that combination. Let's do it. Wait, which one should we bet on? Two, four, five? Okay, 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 here we go. Everyone's like lagging behind. Four is in second place. Five is in fourth place. Six is trying to catch up. All right, that's fine. No one needs to be in the lead now. We'll take our last spots, we'll catch up. We got the stamina, we got the endurance. Let one. Waste all their energy. I don't care. Six is catching up. Okay, six is in second place. All right, we got four and two all the way in the back here. It's okay, they'll catch up, they'll catch up. Wait, no, we don't care about six. We care about five. Why do I keep mixing up six? Who cares about six? Six is a loser bird. All right, five, 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 five. Five is in second place. All right, we need two and four to catch up. Two and four, okay, two is catching up. Two is in second place. All right, five is falling behind. That's fine, just two. Let, let three expend all their energy. We need six to make, no, who cares about six? Five to make it come back. I'm still getting so confused. Who cares about six? Two, four, five. All right. They're all in, in like third, fourth, and fifth place. We can't have this. All right. Who the heck is? Okay, five, 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 five. Five is in second place. Five is in second place. Who the heck is six? Get the heck out. Okay, four. Four is in second place. Two is very close behind. They can catch up. We can get uh, an overwhelming victory by five here as well. All right, four. Four is in second place. I need, I need two and five to step up, like, right now. All right, four has taken first place. Five, I need to jump all the way to two, like, now, okay? Five, get on it, step on it. All right, I want to see that stamina. Put it to work, step on it. Four is taking the lead, but I need these numbers to catch up. Five and two, what are you doing? Why are you slacking? Six actually was the good number. We trashed on six, but it came in second place. I'm sorry, Karmic. Only during these chocobo races. So maybe me accidentally betting on six was not a bad idea. Oral, what the heck? I lost. Welcome. Only invigorated to win. The registration fee is 200 gil. Is that all right? <laughs> Which rank would you like? Ah! Thank you. The I thought we had the winning birds. All right, how's this looking? Look at John. John's just gonna expend all of his energy fast. Four looks okay. Mike looks okay with stamina too. I do like John and Mike. Four and five. This one looks also promising, but bad stamina. No. 
We learned that's not good. Four and five. What if we bet on the underdog, Sarah? One, four, and five. I'm betting on this underdog right here, Sarah. Because they got stamina. 146 is your bet? Okay. I'm 145. Six is not that bad, though. Alright. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's see. Is it going to be your 146 or my 145? 456? I think one's going gonna, gonna to show us all. Okay. 145. Let's go. Let's go. One somehow was in first place. I have no idea how. All right, keeps that lead, falls behind. It's okay, it's okay. We got time, we got time to build up that speed. Da -da 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 -da. Six somehow is in the lead. I don't like this, but that's okay. They might spend all their energy. All right, all right. I need the legs of these chocobos to get to work. Four, five, where are you at? Okay, five is in third place. Four is in second place. We like this, we like this. Six is in third place. Oh my God, oh, wait, no, that's not good. We don't care about six. One in second place. All right, four and five need to catch up. They got time? No worries. I thought four and five were some of my fastest runners. What are you doing? Okay, five. Five is in first place. We're seeing that speed come through. One is in second place. We got consistency from one. We got consistency. Stamina. Not the fastest chocobo on, in the herd, but it's it's very good on stamina. It's keeping up that pace with everyone else. So it's just a little bit faster. All right, one is in second place. Six, who the heck asked you to join this race? I need my four to come through. All right, you're the fast one. You're the fast chocobo. You can't be in fifth place now. All right, one fell behind, overtook six. Okay, we good? We got five and one in first place. That looks good. We like these odds. Keep going, keep going. All right, get the hell out, six. It's not your time. Now your time to shine. All right, I need you to poop the heck out. One and five in first place and second place. We like this. Fourth one, all the way in last, trying to catch up, trying to keep up. One of the fastest birds is not doing well. Why? Come on. Come on! Don't let six, don't let six take you over. I'm so ashamed. Get the heck out, six. Nice, my number one bet came through. I believed. I believed in the consistency of the number one chocobo. They came through with consistency. <laughs> da -na -na -na. Sarah, what a winner. Chocobo right there. Yeah, it was a close second, but too bad. Six just sucked. <laughs> Wait, what did I get? Ice crystal? Heck, another ice crystal. Can't you give me some cool? Won. You may exchange your ticket for I your item ticket is worth. Give me the GP. Like animal race gambling. That's right. You ready to make Welcome. some bets, Alejo? Are you here to buy tickets? The registration fee. I'm gonna bet again. No Which rank would you? Okay. Thank you. There's gonna be some winning chocobos. Alright, what are we looking at? Terry. Not that fast. Above 300 stamina. Alright. Respectable. But honestly, Joel just does everything but you, but better. Like, Joel's got that 95 kilometers and you both got the same stamina. Sorry, Terry, you're out. Joel's in for now. Okay. We got Lee here. Slower than Joel, but they have promising stamina. I got my eye. I got my eye. Lee, you're promising. Okay. Then we have Pow here with even more stamina than Lee, but slower. I, I'm thinking three and four look okay, actually. Then we got Leah, which has to be a pick because they're pretty fast. They got decent stamina as well. What's number six? Heck that. Everyone can do, like, Clive, Terry, and Joel are just, like, competing in the same ranking of stamina here. So, Joel's out. Clive's in. Alright, six. Clive's in. Heck, Joel. We're looking at... We're looking at Lee, 
Number three. I think Clive's gonna be out as well. I'm looking for some consistency here. Lee and Pow. Three and four and five. Three, four, and five. Three, four, and five. Three, four, and five. Okay. Three, four. Four, five. Three, five. I'm not I'm not a Clive believer. I've changed my mind. I think these are the winning chocobos. Pow. Lee. They may not be the fastest, but they'll keep up with everyone else. And then we got a fast runner. I think six? It is an average. Nah, nah, nah. Nah, nah, Six, six ain't winning. Six ain't winning. There's a mega elixir on the line here. Alright. Three. Four. Five, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. See how you do well. How you do, Vitor. Three, four, five, let's go. Three's in the lead. Dang, they're freaking running fast. Three wasn't even the fastest chocobo in the herd. Look at that stamina. Well, you're gonna waste all your stamina, though. What are you doing? Okay, three and four. They're in first and second place. Okay, sound start, but I don't know. Six looking to threaten that. Six, I need you to get out of here. Look at that three just taking the leads. I know, I'm already running. But I do have stamina. We'll see if we've already wasted it or not. But that was just a, like one of my safety picks. It was a safe pick, all right? But I'm really betting on four and five. Five still has time to show their like potency, but they're just like, they're waiting. They're waiting for these other chocobos to like burn themselves out. Because five's gonna like put the nitro on and freaking kick those legs as hard as they can. All right, five taking first place. Look at that. Right around that bend. They saw the opportunity. They took it. They went for the early worm. All right, go, go, go. Go five. Go five. I need I need four and I need three to some action here. All right. Four is falling behind. Three is all the way in the last. But it's okay. We got time. We got time. We got time. Five. Five is like miles ahead of everyone else. Kind of, sort of, maybe. Four. All right, four. You're showing promise. This is why I bet on you. All right. Keep it up. Keep it up, four. All right. It's okay. You got this. Yes. Yes. No six in sight. Get out of here, six. We didn't believe in the Clive. It was the four five combo. It was a four five combo. Da -da. Bow, 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 bow. Look at that. I'm a chocobo expert now. <sighs> Why won't you give me any mega elixirs? What's wrong with you? Really? So who who are, how can I check their stats? Who are Leah and, and, and Paul? I won. You were these the safe picks I did? I think they were, they were my safe stamina like picks. Your item one of them was my stamina pick and the other one was a fast one. Welcome! The registration... No, yeah. Which rank would you... Thank you! <laughs> the next race will be starting soon. I'm glad they're gonna relive your childhood. Alright, okay. I only got 20, I know, right? I don't know why. Okay, l okay, let's see. Tim, how you looking, Tim? Uh, we got 104 speed, stamina 313. You're a nice all-rounder. I'm feeling okay about it. Okay, T's a little slow, but they got endurance. Then we're looking at this. Whoa, Lee's looking real strong. Look at that stamina. Look at that speed. I'm liking Lee. I'm liking Tim. I'm liking what I see. No, Harvey's just not it. I'm sorry. This number four is looking weak. Look at that top speed. Oh, then you got Ellen. 101, 320. That's very close to the stats of Lee. Oh, and then you got Sam. How do you pick between these? I mean, just Sam just does everything better than Ellen. So six. All right. Six is definitely a contender. And Lee. So three, five, and six. Three, five, and six.
You're betting on one? The endurance one? 104 and 313. It's not a bad bet, honestly. It's like kind of an all-rounder bird here. Okay, minor three five, three five six. So we got Lee over here. You're with me this time, okay. Ellen, very close stats to Sam. Sam's just slightly faster and slightly better endurance. And that's one. T just kind of looks worse than everyone else. He does have okay endurance though. We got three, five, six, let's go. Make your picks, lock them in, we're betting. We go now. Everyone got their picks? You've chosen? No more trashing on six, finally. <laughs> Maybe today's the day that six actually wins. We don't even know if it's gonna win, win amongst everyone else. All right, let's see. Let's do this. Let's do this. Three, five, six, let's go. All right, who's in first place? Uh, I don't know who this number four is, but they better be losing very soon. But yeah, waste that energy four. That's right. We like to see that. Look at you. You think you're being so a hot shot right now. But all you're doing is just trying to show that you might be slightly faster than three. But no, three's got the stamina on you, buddy. Three's got a stamina on you. You think you're the pinker bird? No, you're not. Pale pink is where it's at. Get the heck out of here. Get out of this race. All right, four. Four's gonna will out. We got three and six lining up to take over four now. They're waiting. They're waiting to snipe. It's gonna happen. Five is just pacing themselves. They got all day. They got all day. Six running some interference with the back line here. That's okay. That's okay. Three. Three, the pale pink bird coming through. All right. Everyone getting so clustered here. But the strong birds are gonna remain. See, we got three. Three is in second place. Six and five. They're gonna catch up any moment now. Wait, did I bet three, three, five, and six? I think I bet on three, five, six. What did I bet on? Three, five, six, yes. Okay. How is four still in the game? Get the heck out, four. We need you out. Okay, four. Four's in the lead. Get the heck out. It's still, how did they manage to maintain the lead this far? Okay, now they're falling all the way in the back. One and two. Who the heck are these birds? I didn't bet on these birds. Three, three. I need you to step it up. Six, I need you to catch up like now. Like not yesterday, like now. We got six, we got five. We got, who the heck is one? Three, five, and six now. Where's the stamina from one coming from? Who the heck is one? I think Vitor made the right picks here. What happened to three? Three was trying to show off of four the entire time. How'd you win? Who the heck was one? Oh, was Tim the all-rounder? Tim was the all-rounder, wasn't it? Antarctic wins. I lost. Well, the thing is, I can put them in. Welcome. Are but you sure that means I'm gonna need to see everyone's combinations. It's, yeah. All right, we can do it. We can do it. We can do it. Split, yeah. The registration. Nope. Which race? We can do some gambling. Be Thank you. The next race will be. Okay, I need you to make your picks chat, all right? Let's look at that. Let's look at our birds. 99 speed on Dario with 305 stamina. Next up, we have Gary. Slightly more stamina than Dario, but a slower bird. Okay. Then we have Sam. Who's more speed than Gary, but slightly less stamina than Gary, but less than Dario. All right, these are some hard picks already. And then we got Ellen with stamina for days, 93 speed. I like it better than Sam. John is a slow bird, but definitely stamina efficient. And then you got 308 stamina, with top speed of 105. Okay, I like Marie. I'm a bet on six. I'm also going to bet on four.
I'm bet on one. I'm betting on one, four, and six. All right, hold on. Let's set up a prediction. What other bets do we got? One, four, six. We got a two, four, six. Do you need to look at your birds some more? Do we need more time with the birds? Any other choices? Here, let me look at the birds. I'm gonna cycle with them one more time. I don't know, I have a feeling John might come through. 317 stamina, 80, 18 kilom 88 kilometers, not that bad. Dario, 99, 305. Gary, 91, 307. Sam, 93, 304. 93 and 30, 16. I don't know, five kind of looks promising. Is back to the future speed? All right, okay. Well, if we don't think there's any variations, we're gonna bet on this number. All right, one four six and two four six. These are your numbers. Five can be good. I know, right? Well, if anyone if anyone wants to bet on the five, let me know. I'm betting on one four six. Okay, there's some people that are betting on two four six. If anyone wants to make a five combination, let me know. Like a wild card, it could be. That's that's what you bet on though. Like, sometimes you put a wild card in the mix, and you hope that it pays off. Five is only one stamina better than four, and four has, um, and four before has, uh, five more speed. Yeah. All right. Doesn't seem like anyone wants to bet big. Hi, Mikola. So it's one, four, six, and two, four, six. Let's start the prediction. The prediction is going to last one minute. All right. Bet your channel points. I'll make my selections. Wait, why am I betting on Dario? Was there a reason I was betting on that? Okay. One, four. One, six. Four, six. All right, cool. And if no one wins, that's a good point. We have to find out. <laughs> Maybe we'll refund the points. Dang, you're going all in on these bets. Yeah, we should have put in. No, we should have put it like. No, but then other is such a safe bet. Just putting other just means that people can bet on other and then they'll like win. No, no, we're committing. We're committing. Put your points in. Restarting this race. Here we go. Okay, I bet one, four, and six. Let's go. Let's go, birds. Let's go. All right, we got one all the way in the back, six all the way in the back, four in third place. That's okay. That means two and three. They look like they're going to tire themselves out. Look at these loser birds. I'm sorry. What we bet on two? This bird looks like it's going to exhaust itself. Actually, it's kind of keeping pace. It's not bad. Three, though. Not looking good for three. All right. Four is in second place now. Four taking the lead of, on that curve. All right. Six. Where you at, six? Where you at? All the way in the back. All the way in the back with one. They're buying their time. They're buying their time. That's okay. I just need one, six, or four to win. All right. One. Finally catching up with his friends. In second place. Six. In third. All right. We're looking clean. We're looking clean. As long as two doesn't make an appearance, we're good. I'm, I'm very comfortable with these standings. Though five is kind of looking... Oh. No one bet on five, but it kind of does have that promise. I don't know. 
It's looking a little threatening here. Five and six interchanging consistently over and over and over again. But four, one, and six seem to be the winning Chocobo so far. Six is taking over to second place. One trying their hardest here. Four putting all their effort in here for the last stretch. And it is literally every single one of those numbers. One, four, six. You believe, chat. You believed. Cash out for the one, four, six combo. Who bet? Who bet number one? <laughs> Da, 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 da. Let's pay out. Give that cash to chat. Big winners today. All those channel points. It was really clean, right? Like they just overtook at some point and they like they they got the game. They had the game. We got right when it mattered. <laughs> nice. So what did we got we got mega elixir. Yo, what's a mega elixir, chat? I won. Do I need to grab this? You may exchange your ticket for an item or GP. So I get the item this I'd time? Li I'd like the item. I need to know if I need to get a GP or the item. Are great. It's an elixir, but mega. Let's see. Let's see, was it worth it? Fully restores all members HP and MP. Ooh. That could be clutch in a fight. Nice. Welcome. All right. Okay, chat. We're gonna do it. We're gonna at least do it nope. one more time, like and then we're gonna proceed the story. We can always come back. Okay. B. Thank you. The next the you can use the battle. Soon. All right. Nice. Okay. Let's look at our birds. I need you to have a notebook and a pen or paper or a keyboard, whatever it is, your mobile. All right. Jot down these numbers, and then we're gonna make our predictions. John. Fantastic stamina, not the fastest bird in the herd. Terry, whoop! Okay, Terry, you're already looking cleaner than John. Look at that, 91, 329. Might be the most stamina we've seen in the bird yet. All right, Terry looking clean. Never mind, Sandy, look at that. What the heck with all these high stamina birdies? All right, 104 kilometers. Faster than Terry, much faster than Terry, but 327 stamina. That's looking good. I like number three. Number three is all right, okay? Then we seem to have this all-rounder bird here, Leah. 315 stamina, not as much as everyone else, but she's a pretty fast bird. She's 98 kilometers. She's tracking a 98. I know, I feel okay about Leah here. I'm feeling good about Sandy. Sandy and Leah, you need to see the rest. Wow, Ben big, okay. What about number five? What if number five just blows everyone out of the park? Let's see, number five, what's it gonna be? No, that's just a weaker pick, Andy. That's not a good pick. Okay. Never mind. Number five is out for me. Then we got T. 98, 314. How's that compared to Leah? Just slightly worse than Leah. Alright, my picks are in. Alright. We got Leah. We got Sandy. Who else? I might go two, three, four, actually. Yeah, I'm doing two, three, four. That's my picks. Let's do two, four. Yeah, that's it for me. Okay, so Nikon wanted three, two, one. I'll show you the bets here in a second, okay? We got... Let's set up a prediction. I was two, three, four. I'll put mine in the leads. Two, three, four. Um, which... Burb. Burbs. Um, what are the other picks? We got two, three, six is a vote. Um, Nikon vet for three, two, one. And we also had a pick for one, two, three. All right. Okay, I have four bets in here. I'm gonna start the prediction. I'll keep that up on screen for like two minutes. All right, then you're gonna vote. I'm gonna scroll through the birds again. All right, your birds are up now. Oh yeah, it is. You're right. <laughs> you are absolutely right. It's okay. Be don't don't bet for one, two, three. 
Don't bet for one, two, three. I'm an idiot. Wait, we can delete it. We can delete it. We can delete it. Hold on. That's okay. We'll do it again. My bad. That's literally the same. Two, three, four. One, two, three. And two, three, six, right? Two, three, six was the last one. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, it's the same thing. Same thing. Didn't even notice that. Okay, you got two minutes. We'll look through the birdies again. Okay, we're gonna focus on one. All right, this is number one. All right, you got number one on screen here. 88 kilometers, 327 stamina, all right? Now, we're gonna look at two. 91 speed, 329 kilometers, all right? That's your number two pick. Your number three is 104 at 327 uh, stamina. It's slightly less than Terry here, but definitely a faster bird, all right? Number four, all right, is 98 kilometers. Slower than the last, but an average, like stamina. I feel like this is our, like, safety bird, right? They got average stats. Ignore five, we don't care about five, we didn't bet for five. Now this is number six. 98 is a speed, 314 is a stamina, all right? That's like... Worse stamina than John, but much better speed. And then it's like much better speed than Terry, but worse stamina. And then it's like definitely all around worse. Wait. Than Sandy here. I don't know. Three just looks like a really safe bet. We got number four here. Two, three, four. Okay. I'm team two, three, four, two. Okay, it seems like it's split in the middle. Only one person bet, I think, on one, two, three. All right, we'll see. Maybe one, two, three shows us all, and then we all lose points. All right, it's all gonna pull into like one, two, three. Let's go. Let's go. All right. I'll explain it to you Oleho next game, okay? I'm betting on two, three, four. Let's go. Let's go, birdies. Let's go. Let's go. Why is four just like showing off all their speed now? I need you to, like, chill out. Two and four are being super competitive right now. I don't like this. I don't like that two and four are being super competitive right now. Okay, even three is being super competitive. What's happening? Okay, three is falling behind a little bit. Hi, Eep. Welcome in. We're gambling. All right. Okay. I like where I like where three is at now. All right. Two and three need to slow down a little bit so you can overtake later. Four just go very fast. But they're losing their position right now. They're being jostled by other chocobos. All right, two and four. I'm okay with this. I need three to like speed up just a tiny bit, just in case here that we start to like lose our position. Who the heck is five? Did anyone bet? No one bet on five. No one bet on five. Who the heck is five? They're gonna ruin it for us all. We're gonna lose because five somehow just decided to take second place. What the frick? No, three, catch up. Three, get it, move it, move it. Hustle! Hustle! Hustle, birdies! Oh my god, six is coming out of nowhere. Get the heck out, six. No one asked you. No one asked you. Three, speed up. Three, speed up. Three, speed up. Three, speed up. Yes, yes, yes. Speed up three. Speed up three. What? Who the hell is one? Get the heck out! No, no, no. Three, three. Come on. Come on. Push it. Push it, three. Push it, three. I need to see those numbers. Come on. You're in fourth place. What are you doing? Yes, yes. Come on. Overtake five. Overtake five. Overtake five. Six. That's fine. I'm okay with that. All right. Come on. Three, two, six. Yes! The clutch! The last second! We almost lost to five and made us all lose points. Oh my god. Who? See, someone was saying five looks like a good one, but no one bet on it. No one bet on it. <laughs> it was close for you, Heislin. It was close. Yeah! Two, three! Wait. Wait, hold on. Did we all win? That's a really good point. <laughs> Who won? Because everyone bet on two and three. And two and three won. I don't think we thought this through. <laughs> we all win. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I don't know what to do now.
Do I'll just like do I delete it? No one wins. I could just delete it. Just give me all your dew points. I'll distribute them. <laughs> True. That, oh, we didn't think this through. Maybe we should have had it in an order. We win our own bet back. Yeah, you can have those points. Whichever one was closest. So like what? The combinations. So like two and three. Where's four? Four's in last. So two, three, six would win. Oh no, you're right. But then the, how do we, that, that just makes the betting more complicated. Because like no one, only Heisland bet on two, three, and one, and they had the best standings on the list. But they didn't win the race, right? Because the winners of the race are two and three. The combos were two, three, four, one, two, three, and two, three, six. Because the true winners of the race are not are, are going to be very different bets than like people just winning on the 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 best three in the listing. Yeah, one two three would win. <laughs> and income Cedric is like, oh, I would just drop one hundred thousand points because I can. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah i think we need to, i think we need to delete this one because we didn't really understand how to do that yeah but also one two three was the closest it's true it's all down the drain oh i'm i'm not feeling very satisfied about dishing points out now it's okay you all get your points back but yeah then it technically was heisland with one two three that would have won like your your mo your money's back. It's okay. It's okay. And what happened the first time? Did we scam <laughs> the voters of 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 the other bets? I didn't gamba. <laughs> oh, how do we then? How do we set up predictions then? How do you set up predictions? Because then it's like, yeah, maybe multiple people's picks would have won. So like, honestly. If someone big, big bet 236, their bet would have just been as valid as my 234. Like, both of those would have been winners at the end of the day. We need to have a bet that covers every ticket. Yeah, me too. I need to gamble them too, but I, ne I can't figure out this like complex system now. Oh my god. Okay, I got a tranquilizer, by the way. I like the tranquilizer. Oh! <gasps> My life is in shambles. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? That was like a whole day of betting. That was literally every mini game lost because you can't freaking save in here unless you pay 5 GP. It's like we got robbed on the way out. I mean, technically I got my guild back, but... They get robbed. I know, you walk out with your winnings from like the freaking casino and then you get held up at gunpoint. That crash was gunpoint. <laughs> at least you get the 10k from the basketball game back. <laughs> we got thrown out for being too good shot. Oh, no. That's so sad. My mega elixir. My chocobo story. 
We noticed you were talking to people that has to drink the rice. We're gonna ask you to leave. It's blackjack turning one all over again. <laughs> Maybe this is the best reality. The reality where the house, yeah, the house always wins. The reality where I literally get all my gill back. Nothing wasted, but nothing gained. We still have the memories though, chat. We still have the memories. We, we have to make a comeback at the gold saucer, but I was going to stop at this point anyways to just do some story for a little bit. Cause stream crash and I get my 100k. We got so invested. I'm heartbroken, chat. It was divine intervention. Too much gamba. Oh no. Yeah, all the experience and none of the cost. True, they were they were nice stream experiences. We can't deny that. Like, we gotta have a good time. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna come back. Don't worry. We'll come back to Gold Saucer, but right now we're just going to take a story break. We got the memories though, it's okay. Such a shame though. I really didn't expect the game. If you come back uh, too late, it'll be gone. When is too late? Can, can chat just tell me when it's too late? And then I'll be sure to come back before then. <laughs> Bye, Haleo. If you're on disc 2. Will someone give me a heads up before disc 2? Since you were 10. Do you lose all your money there, Liv? Is this... Is this... Hold on. Let me ask them a question. Is this area we were trying to go last time, disc two? Past Gungaga? Nice crit, 1,790. When Aerith leaves your party during the story and you decide to rescue her, rescue her becomes disc two. Well, if you see me reaching disc two point, just just give me a heads up. Stone stairs. Bad. Missed that time though. Become separate. It's okay, next time we go to the gold saucer, we'll have more money than ever. Now oh, there's so many of these dinosaur thingies. That actually works. All the stones there on clouds. That time it missed. Nice. The death blow came in. Nice. Hi, Zeno. You missed a heartbreaking stream. 
We've just suffered a huge loss. All right, let's go over to this other crossing here. So we spent all day betting in the casino at the gold saucer, all day. We got lots of GP, a lot of items. We got invested on chocobo racing. Everyone was making bets left and right. Channel points were spent. And in the final bets, the game crashed and all progress was lost. So technically nothing in game was lost because other than GP, we got all of our guild back. But what costs? We kept the experiences, lost everything else. We became expert gamblers are more confident for the next round. Yeah. Hi, Kerva. Late disc 2 content? I want that mega elixir. We probably will do some more chocobo gambling, don't worry. But it was only the one chocobo. Or what do you call mega elixir? Hi, Morgan. Welcome in. Nice to see you. Hope you're doing well. Someone tell me the other day that someone like literally spent um, leveling to 9-9 in the first area without ever leaving. Doing okay, Kerbo. A bit of brain fog today. Looking forward to the weekend. How about you? Animation takes forever to play out, actually. Oh, these misses. I gotta turn one away from us at the very least. Some workout, look forward to relaxing. Hell yeah. We have some people in here that smashed their workout as well today. Nice job. Alright, what is this cliffy area here? This place is new. Oh, Max? Not what I was expecting. We do have a thunder though. Wait, what is it called? It's a golem. Looks like a mechanical golem to me. Could manipulate. Level 24. No weaknesses. Why no weaknesses? You're literally made of metal. Oh, it's getting closer. Jeez, I actually don't want to know what happens when it gets closer. Luckily, Cloud does a lot of damage. Spooky. Just working. It's cold. I made the mistake of wearing a skirt. Oh no! Did you have like like? Oh, what did I do? What's happening? Why is this game being so cursed today? Like tights or anything like that on? Oh, I hope you have like some sort of like jacket or blanket or something to put on your lap. Keep yourself warm when you're indoors at the very least. Ski skis! I don't know what their weakness is. We can try a blizzard on them. Sorry, but I gotta. Oh, oh she so stole close. something rather than like. What the heck? I, I feel like I'm menuing all wrong.
they keep turning around. Okay, they don't seem to have a, as much HP as I thought. I see it! A blanket and a husky you brought to work. You have a pet husky? Rage power. Wow, that dealt a lot of damage. I kind of want to manipulate these to see if we can get anything out of them. I didn't read if they had a weakness, but we'll check next time. It's not often that Cloud dies in the party. Yeah, but this thing deals a lot of damage. Maybe the materia Aerith can have. Do we have restore on her or the um let's see not this one? Cura, can we change this to Where's our other materia here? I'm looking for a specific materia. It's not seal. Does Red have it? Which is the one that, that brings people back to life? Heal magic? It's the heal magic. No. Life. Revive. There we go. We already have it. Magic. Use... Why can't we revive? Restores life. There. Not enough of me. Okay. Extreme confusion hours. Alright, there we go. I like it, Cobalt. Every time I see a girl in a skirt and it's chilly, I'm like, what are you doing? I mean... Kudos to them for being able to actually get through it. But I generally will wear like a pair of tights that keeps my legs a lot warmer. I've officially entered Easter holidays, so I'm starting them by chilling with you guys a bit. Aw, Mikla, enjoy your Easter holiday. Have a great time. Do you have any big plans? Or any relaxation you're gonna do? Finger shot, that's new. Show me what you can do! I don't think we've seen this summon before. Nice. Can we manipulate this? Nope. Alright, that died. There's like a few sections here. There's like this um, area on the right. And there's an area on the left as well. I don't think it actually leads to anything. It's just like empty space on the map. Okay, they have their backs turned to us. Rage bomber stuff is annoying. Might actually kill Cloud here. Yeah, he's very close to dying. Somehow Cloud survived. Oh, never mind. He took the blow for Aerith there and dead again. These are kind of annoying, not gonna lie. Oh, 
Oh, that sounds annoying, Alice. I'm sorry. Okay, let's see. Magic. Aerith. Life. Really, it's such an expensive spell. But I kind of want to conserve my Phoenix down just in case. Not like a few centimeters forward and we were already ambushed by these turtle looking fellas. It was fun, Alice. I had a really good time. Oh, Sahagans? There's desert versions of Sahagans? No one told me this. Weak against cold, okay. We manipulated one desert saw again, okay. We have any cold? Blizzard. Who's Blizzard here? Sand gun, huh? I don't know what sand gun does. But we can try it. Oh wait. Keeping a steal. They have to use it on cloud, essentially. Maybe this will do the trick. I'm guessing sand gun might be something, but they didn't learn anything. So let's just attack it. Wait, why one? Why is it only taking one damage? Turtle shell? I didn't see it do that. Maybe only Blizzard works? What do you think of this trick? Blizzard definitely works. Maybe only fire works. Or like just any magic attacks, yeah. Weak to cold. Alright. There's a left path here. And there's a way forward. Okay, there's more Sahagans. I wish I had... of Shiva. Okay, this will be okay. Cold and punch, meaning no equipped weapons. Shiva was my gun, it's okay. But it wouldn't be a bad idea now to like go in and change our materia. Um, Aerith and swap out ice or restore. Just for now. There's something here. Where's this place? Osmo Canyon? This place is new. It's me, 
I'm home. This is his home? Hey, Nanaki. I see you're back in one piece. Nanaki, huh? You should go and greet Master Bogenhagen. This person is very German. Nanaki. Mr. Who? Welcome to Cosmokin. Are you familiar with this area? Not really. Act and allow me to explain. People come here from all over the world to study planetary bioscience. But we are fully booked right now, so I can't let you enter. These people help me a little on my way here. Please let them come in. Oh, is that so? Fully booked was the Nike? Like well, then, please park? enter. What the heck is a Nanaki? Nanaki is Nanaki. That's his name. Let's look around. This Hello. is Cosmo Canyon. It's quite a mystical place, isn't it? Have you also come here to study planetary bioscience? It's good, Zerofast. I'm enjoying it. Not something like that. Not something As I thought. They say there's an incredible observatory here. I'd love to see it if I get the chance. This is... Have you also come here to... As I thought. Okay, I wonder why bioscience, planetary bioscience... Talk to some of these other folks as well. I thought he had like a gem in his head, but it's just a worker helm. Thanks for the story, little girl. I heard it went on long before I was born. The elders say something really, really scary happened. I don't know what. Hi, Pura Sa uh, Same. Welcome in. Nice to have you. This is uh, Umetsu's favorite track in the game. I believe he turned like 60-something recently, didn't he? I see. You're the ones that brought Nanaki back. This makes me hungry. Thank you ever so much. Whatever he's eating, I would like to eat it. Oh, thank you. There's a lot of spirits here as well. Welcome. Would you like to try our original cocktail of the Cosmo Cat? Hell yeah, let's do it. Drinking can be quite beneficial, you know. It comforts the heart. In moderation, of course. Why would they let me try Welcome. it? Welcome. Drinking can be... Like, he just talks about it, but he won't let me drink it. What a shame. This looks like beds. Looks like a place to sleep, like an inn. Welcome to the Shildra Inn. It's times like this that you need a nice, soft bed. No thanks. It's 100... Nah. In that case... We'll think about that in a bit. What's this here? These cocktails are good, but our local brew's the best. Stop paying the turtle lounge. Yo! I keep hearing about this turtle of a lounge, but I've never seen it before. Let's try and climb these. Can you climb these ladders? Yeah, you can. This reminds me of like, um, what's it called in Zelda? The uh, village of the bird people, the Ruto, the Rico, I can't remember. Hello, welcome. Looking for anything in particular? I can't remember too clearly, Gorka. All right, nothing too special here. The Rito, thank you. Yeah, that's what I'm reminded of. Not the Gerudo, no. I guess we can't go anywhere else. It's like literally in and around. The Burrito Village. Oh, I could go for a burrito right now. I just like how they're like... 
whole village or town is like structured on this like cliffside. Making enchilada later? It's also taco night here, but I don't know if we're making enchiladas. Sounds good though. Oh, I thought that was a camel. It's just red. I read. This is my hometown. My clan came to protect this beautiful canyon and those seeking knowledge about the plant. My mother fought bravely and died here as a warrior. Thursdays? People are generally have Taco Tuesdays. Coward? Yes. My father was a despicable coward. I'm all that's left to protect this place. My journey ends here. Oh, Nanaki, you're home! I'm coming, Grandpa. Perfect timing. Why don't we take a break? Let's explore this place on our own for a while. Interesting. Like now he's no longer red, he's just gonna be Nanaki. Oh wait, there's a safe point. Nice. I'll save before my game crashes. <laughs> what can we buy? Oh, we actually have the, the money. The people of this canyon aren't too fond of violence. So just about everything here is a replica. A replica? But not to worry. Some of them are genuine article. That'd be very concerning if you just sold me replicas. Hmm. I think my weapon's better. These are normal growth. We're gonna have to take a look at our options. All of these seem to be upgrades, so. Okay, well, red's no longer in our party. Normal. We already have an M phone here for Katsy. Let me see what our equipment is like. See, his is double. I just kind of don't want to trade that. But then how good is the sword? The people of this- It doesn't do that much more damage. This, however, does so much more damage for Tifa. This one also does much more for Barret. But the thing is, I really would like to be able to equip it on them and see what it's like. I don't know. I can't compare. Is there a way for me to compare? Because they're like not in my party and I can't see their equips. So, like, no way to tell. Is there nothing here? Okay, there's something here. This place is a labyrinth. Master Buggenhagen sealed this door shut. It won't open. Do you think he used super Yeah, glue? super That's exactly what he used to shut this Master door. Master This kid. I think super glue is the answer to everything. Wow, I'm gonna spend time getting lost here. There's so many exits and entrances. Kind of at the top now, though. Okay, that's Master Buchenhagen. Nanaki. Relatable, that stuff just doesn't come out. <laughs> that sounds painful. I hope you didn't like glue two fingers together or something like that. I just play with wood kit, wood glue. Cloud. Age. This is but that my stuff was fun to play with. Bugen. He's incredible. You he did? Knows everything. How do you dissolve super glue? <laughs> oh, I hear that you've been keeping an eye on Nanaki. I am most grateful. For Nanaki is still a child, you see. Oh, Grandpa, I'm 48. <laughs> Nanaki Stribe has incredible longevity. While he may be 48 in human terms, this is really only equivalent to around 15 or 16 by his tribes. 15 or 16? 
He Younger comes across as rather taciturn and pensive. D you like thought he was kitty. an adult? Grandpa, I want to grow up. I want to be able to protect you and the villagers. <laughs> no, Nanaki. You are not quite ready for that yet. You mustn't overstretch yourself, or one day it will destroy you. You've seen it, haven't you? The great Mako City, which stretches up to the heavens, built to grasp at the very stars themselves. That sets a bad example. Looking up all the time makes one lose perspective. He's a wise man, huh? What? What the heck are when you doing? Jumping on the table? When this time is up, only then will we understand. Understand that we know absolutely nothing. The planet will die? <laughs> it may be tomorrow or a hundred years from now, but it has not long to go. How do you know this? I hear the celestial scream. The howling is a celestial scream. What? A sound made by all that sparkles in the heavens. At this very moment, some stars and planets are being born, while others are dying. What was that just now? <laughs> a scream from our planet. I am in pain. I am suffering. Is that not what it sounded Dude like? Dude speaks planet. Cloud and his friends are on a journey to save the planet. Why don't you show them your pride and joy? The machine. Ho 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 ho! Save the planet! <laughs> that is quite impossible. What could mere humans hope to accomplish? But then again, I suppose it can't hurt to show you. Master Bukenhagen! A lot of odd looking people are here again. Now, what's this? This place is rather busy all of a sudden. I wonder if it's Turks. They're Cloud's friends. I'll go on ahead. Maybe it's not them. Oh, yeah, Cloud. You can only bring two of them with you. Grandpa's machine only has space for three people. Only three Not people? Not to worry. My machine won't grow legs and run away. Go and find your friends. Interesting. Like have like uh, cool looking spots. Oh, is that Yuffie? Just a place with a good view. Ugh, I'm so busy. I really could do some help around here. Ugh. Poor woman. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. No way. Scolaris? Are you for real? To the Was that just six months in advance? Oh my god. That's so freaking sweet of you. I don't know what to say. That's so, so freaking sweet. Thank you so much for just helping me along with Partner Plus. I appreciate that. Thank you for the six months of support. Been enjoying the streams. I'm really glad to hear that. That means a lot to me. Thank you so much for the support. I'm sure like that you'll at least enjoy the discount. Enjoy the emotes, the ad free experience, and continue to enjoy your time here. Thank you, thank you so much for the support. I hope you do continue to enjoy them more. I'm all flushed and flustered now, I appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> oh, that's so sweet. Wait, 
Where did my friends go? I appreciate everyone that's been helping me um, push towards Partner Plus. The really cool news is, depending on how April goes, um, we'll likely get the 60-40 split from Twitch in May, which is awesome. And that's one of the potential splits that we can get. If we do happen to like achieve um, 300 for three consecutive months, then we'll unlock like 70-30, which is awesome. Because right now, for those that don't know, I received half of the income from Twitch, so it's a 50-50 split. And in May, if we get like 100 uh, sub points guaranteed, then it'll be a 60-40 when May comes along, because I've already achieved like two months of that. And then if we get to 300 at any point in time, then doing two more months will help us get 70-30, which is really, really awesome. It goes a long way. But I just want to also remind everyone that like my content is free. So if you choose to support, it means the world, but you don't have to. Just being here as a viewer is a lot. Hi, Cellmate. Team, reference you from all the Dragon's Dogma 2 streams. I did mine yesterday, so you're clear now. Um, are you going to be playing the game yourself, Cellmate? Where did I put it? I know it's around here somewhere. What are you doing here, Bear, around all the explosives? What? So wait, based on that, we can put people in our party? you all decide who you should take with you into the party like I feel like this concerns Aerith but at the same time it's like Barrett's and Tifa's goal to like save the planet I kind of want to put Tifa in here but I also really want to take Barrett we need to really play with uh, Kachi a little bit yeah, I feel like these two girls are like kind of easy picks for me. Just favorites. Alright, well we got our party. Maybe I should have found them first before like actually just popping them into my inventory. Let me make another save just in case. Also now, with them in my party, I can actually check their equipment. I'm not gonna change fairy tale. Tifa has a double growth. Right. Even though she has a double growth, this Hello, weapon. Uh, the people of this. is just really good improvement for her. Like from 27 to 38, just looks really good. And has four slots. I might go for that for Tifa, actually. Tiger Fang. Which means we can equip some all materia here. Yeah, link materia is just kind of really cool here. Maybe what I can do. Do I have an element? Arrange. No, exchange. Mm, does Yuffie have it? Transform. Where's my elemental one? We got two alls in here. Elemental here. That's where it is. So now we can decide to put something like fire on the all and make her weapon deal fire damage. And then we can steal an all from Barret and put something like I don't know, earth magic for example. Steel is still very good. Long range is good. And then we can put a summon on her. At the very least. Lightning magic. Earth magic. Now all the summons are kind of on Aerith, but we just need her to be able to get more MP. The 
That would be really nice. Now it's fun, but different than I expected, but it's good. Are you playing it on console or PC, Selmay? You're doing the same thing? You're also playing Dragon's Dogma 2? Hi, Zylo. Happy Friday. How you doing? So good to see you. I played ahead in the morning so I could watch Ayn, but he's just rushing main quest, so he caught up. There's so much to do in the world in Dragon's Dogma that I felt like it's so distracting. I couldn't just play, like, um... Main story. Is that all I need to do? <gasps> Excuse me. Just grab my party members? Is there anything else I need to do beforehand? Wait, why can't I go from here? There we go. Sorry about the yawns. Run through every bush. Understandable. Never know what's lurking. Yeah, it's hard to keep up with a streamer because I can understand from a streamer perspective, unless they are trying to do a hundred percent playthrough or completionist, they might just kind of like do the quest line so they can play another game. Yeah, over here. Afterwards, the once door's done. unlocked. Can you climb this ladder? I want to see what, what's around here. A little ladder here. Can we look at this telescope. Dragon's Dogma 2 refugees assemble. It's okay, this is the refuge, yeah. The safe haven from spoilers. I, I totally understand with like new releases, you know, like. A lot of people nice. don't want to like watch people and want to have their own experiences, which is why like sometimes I struggle with like picking up a game on release and playing it on stream. Sometimes I'll do it, but not very often I'll do it immediately. Like Rebirth, one of the incentives of me not doing it was because I knew people were going to be playing it. Plus it gives me some time to experience like 7 OG so I can have a complete experience. I just know some games are like a huge investment for a lot of people that like you probably are not going to be watching streamers play for quite a while. I waited while watching any people playing Rebirth myself until I had finished it. Yeah, now you can catch up with me afterwards. I finally dive into it. Oh, are you ready? Then let us begin. All right. Stand there. Show me the universe, Gramps. It's a slippery slope, Cellmate, because some people have enough viewers that, like, they can... They can just stream a new game and people will watch, and some people suffer a lot when they play a new so game. So pretty! It's just like the real thing, Cloud. Ho-ho! <laughs> Isn't it marvelous? I take great pride in this laboratory of mine. All the workings of the universe have been entered into this three-dimensional holographic system. I really want to see what this looks system. like in Rebirth. Earth is so amazed. Look at her. She's like, look, a planet. Wow, asteroids. A shooting star. She's so amazed. But wait. A black hole? Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, yes, indeed. Well, let us get to the matter at hand. Man must eventually die. But what happens after death? The body decays and returns to the planet. That much we all know. But what of consciousness? The heart? The spirit? It too returns to the planet. And not only that of man, 
the same applies to all living things on the planet. Nay, the whole universe. The spirits that return to the planet join together and race around it. They form a surge that rushes, converges, and separates constantly all over the planet. We call this the life stream. Life stream. A path of spiritual energy which flows around the planet. Spiritual energy. Never forget the term. New life. Children are blessed with spiritual energy and are brought into the world. And when the time comes, they die and return to the planet once more. There are some exceptions, of course, but this is essentially how our world operates. I and mean, when you have an abundance it's of spiritual a lot to take energy in. over time? But perhaps you'll understand it all better if you watch this. all becomes the same life force. Oh wait, it's the same life force that gives birth to more. So it's not like you have more spiritual energy. Spiritual energy is the source of life for trees, birds, and man. No, no, not only for creatures. The planet itself depends upon spiritual energy. But what if that energy were to disappear? I guess that's what we're harvesting and using through materia. That's so we're able to cast magic. I guess there's a point where the macro reactors will These deplete all the, the energy. These are the basics of planetary bioscience. If the planet is deprived of spiritual energy, it'll perish. Ho 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 ho! Spiritual energy fulfills its roles precisely because it is one with nature. When spiritual energy is forcibly extracted and processed, it is prevented from accomplishing its true reason for being. You're talking about Mako energy, right? Mako reactors are rapidly depleting the spiritual energy of our planet. The reactors produce highly concentrated spiritual energy, which they call Mako. But it is the planet itself that is being consumed. In other words, the use of Mako energy has only one outcome. The complete destruction of our planet. That was so anticlimactic, just like getting that, that on platform. That was the tale of our planet. And those who inhabit it. Do you wish to learn more? Then you'd be wise to listen to the words of the elders. So, like, basically, um, there's like this like normal cycle on this planet where like spiritual energy is like breathed into new life, and then when it returns back, and then just keeps cycling over and over. But like basically, humans put a big like tap into it, like a tree and try to extract that resin and then just like use it and expend it elsewhere and then suddenly that energy can't return back to the earth. So I guess it does tap out. Um, it's like powering your house with the spirits of the dead, rather unpleasant to think about. Yeah, that's pretty dark. Hello weekday, so nice to see you. Happy Friday, welcome in. I hope you're excited for the weekends. Yo, Stevicus, what's up? I saw Frost Metal's Dark Souls run, and I want to come by and say hi. Um, also, I would have to say Japanese curry is your favorite comfort food. Okay, Stevicus, first of all, means the world to me that you stopped in. 
from the Frost Hotels run. Thank you so much. It's so nice to see you. I hope you're having a fantastic Friday. And I'll let you know, I literally made Japanese curry last night from scratch. Curries are like amazing comfort food. So I whipped it up, it was delicious. I even had like a side of like a puff pastry thing that I dipped into the curry and the flakes of the puff pastry and the curry were like out of this world. So good, very good pick. Um, I do wish, however, I made it a slight bit more spicy. Yeah, curries is always so solid. Like I love like warm, hot dishes like that. It's good for the soul. Yeah. Um, but I just made like a classic one. Uh, I, w I would like to experiment more with like some like Indian curries. I mean, when you're saying it's like powering your house with the spirits of dead, most feel burned to create energies from coal. Coal is the compressed bodies. I mean, it's literally the same thing in our life. It's true. But the problem is I don't think there's anything wrong with burning the coal. Because ultimately, yeah, everything returning to the earth is kind of a natural cycle. Like, I think that's fine because like us being buried and stuff like that, we give back to the earth after we like are born into it. Um, but however, the problem with that cycle, Gorka, I would say is probably the carbon emissions. It's not so much like reusing these um, resources to basically like power our life and, and be able to fuel like new living, but it's like the abundance of it that we're using to do stupid stuff, essentially, and thus burning the planet. So we're, we're in essence doing the exact the same thing Final Fantasy that I was talking about. Yeah, Mako's like oil, right. It, so this is a voice mod um, called Echo S and it's fantastic. It's very charming. It's very quirky. Yeah, exactly, Weekday. Yeah, there is truth in it. There is truth in it. And it's it's sadly very dark picture to think about. This one just tries to hit you like it's more direct, like, oh, these are like people and then the planet's gonna fall apart. Nanaki said his father was a coward? So, Nanaki, that's what you believe. Tifa didn't say anything in that cutscene, did Nanaki she? Said so interesting like Aerith had a reaction and like Tifa I believe said absolutely nothing I kind of wonder if I took like bear or something would have been a bit different so I guess I gotta go find my friends My friends, anyways. Oh, everyone's sitting around the fire. I guess we share our learnings together. Thank you, Steve, because I appreciate it. I'm having a blast. Thanks for coming and saying hello. What a boring place. Just like I thought. I want to go somewhere else. Let's go hunt for some materia. If only she knew. How would the Wutai clan feel? Cosmo Canyon. Avalanche was born here. I promised the guys. Promised them that once we've saved the planet from Shinra, we'd go to Cosmo Canyon and raise a toast. Thanks. Wedge. Wedge. Literally the same order. Jesse. Jesse. Gone. Yeah, see you around. Have a great weekend. They all gone. All for the sake of the planet. Is that the truth? Hey, though? Jana. Welcome in. Was it for the planet? Now we. I, I just hate Shinra. What right? Do I have to continue on this journey? What would they... What would they think of me now? I'll never know. If there's anything I can do to save the planet, or the people living on it, then I'm gonna do it. I'll leave it to the others to decide if it's justice or revenge. Uh, I'm gonna do it! 
Barris, reborn. settle down. Avalanche is reborn! Hey, buddy. I hope you like your first playthrough of Final Fantasy VII OG. When you're done, I really recommend playing the remix as well. So I played the first remake, but the idea, putty, is most likely we're gonna do this. So like, talk to chat about this. We're gonna play the OG. We're gonna play Crisis Core, and then we're gonna play Rebirth. Um, since we have already done remake, I'm still uncertain if I want to replay remake on stream. Um, it's likely, it's possible, but like I. I might streamline it and just go, like, Crisis Core Rebirth after OG. We'll see, though. I wonder how many years it's been since then. Gosh, I'm remembering all sorts. I wonder how- Gosh. Remembering all sorts of what? How many years since when? I learned a lot. The Elders taught me many things. About the Setra and the Promised Land. I'm... Alone. Hard, but that would take I'm a long alone. time. That would be a fun challenge. But I'm. Uh, we're here for you. Oh, Cloud, slipping up, aren't you? I know, I know, but I'm all that's left of the Setra. Does that mean we can't help? Not okay. There's nothing to say. Bonfires are strange, aren't they? They make you remember all sorts of things. Cloud, five years ago... No, never mind. I mean, it would be fun. I can't ask you about I that. I started a hard mode right after I finished... Why not? ...remake, um, Because you'll my change. Own. You'll... It was a good time. ...drift away from me again. Cloud, you really are yourself, right? So what do we do? Reborn. Cloud. A long time ago, when I was still very small. Hey, Vorpal, I see you. No. Happy Friday. I, I don't want to talk about it. What is it? It's about my parents. When I talk of my mother, my chest bursts with pride, and that's great. When it comes to my father, my heart is filled with rage. You still can't forgive him? Of course not. He... let my mother die. When the Gi attacked, he ran off alone. He abandoned her and the people of the canyon. Come, Nanaki. There is something you should see. It's a little dangerous. Cloud, will you and one other accompany us? Yeah, Eris, um, I understand she's definitely must be lonely, like, just to be this race that no one can relate to. No one has, like, experiences that she could talk to about. It definitely creates like a unique kind of loneliness and even though you could be surrounded by like a lot of people that you love and stuff it's just like everyone needs someone to identify with it's just like that's just so important it's really really sad hi quest hi nautilus nice to see you happy friday Very happy I spent a couple hours playing Dragon's Dog on 2 last night, and I, by that I meant I spent an hour and a half making Shadowheart in the character creator, and then got to play the actual game for half an hour before reading and going to bed. Yo, Vorpal, that sounds cozy. Hopefully you'll have more time today. What, like, kinship with someone you can relate with? Someone you can talk to? Oh, wait, he's right there. The uh, door doesn't open. Oh, ho, ho. Are we all set? 
guess so. Oh, oh, oh. Then shall we get going? That's a big red button. Alright. In you go. I wonder what's in this uh, hole. Won't you be leading the way, Grandpa? What? I thought I said it was a little dangerous. You'd have an old man go in first. <laughs> I'll be right behind. Yeah, it's a voice of our Nautilus. Okay, so he's joining us. I don't mind if I'm alone. I don't identify as anything. I'm not proud of my heritage. I don't feel connected to a part of it. I'm just me. Everyone is just them. Um, I'm not like uh, very nationalistic either. I don't have a lot of pride in that kind of stuff. Um, but there is some truth to like my upbringing had certain flavors and certain experiences that some people in the world want, might not be able to relate to. So it's kind of nice to have someone to talk to about this stuff because a lot of people just have very different experiences growing up than I do. Um, and even though like maybe you don't have any pride in that, there's a bit of culture and like... It could be like culture, nationality, religion or anything like that could like impart its way on you. And unless you don't identify with it anymore and you grow very distant in it, sometimes it's nice to know that like, oh, I wasn't the only one. Like I, I can be on stream now and talk about things in my childhood and be like, huh? Then I would have no idea what I'm talking about. And it can be nice for someone in chat to be like, oh yeah, I know exactly what you're going on about. Um, and, and that can that can be a nice feeling. But you know, if, if you've like managed to transcend like that portion of identity and just like find like comfort in yourself, then that sounds awesome, Gorka. I think that's a pretty hard challenge for most, though. There's a little materia up there I want to get. I feel like I was in these caves. A strange looking rock. Break it open. Like, this is where we bumped into the Turks as we were first making our way into the overworld. So there's a specter here. I don't have any materia on red here, so I'm a little concerned. Weak against fire. Okay. I think that happens anywhere in the world, Mano, but I understand. It can be very frustrating to watch that. I don't know if breaking the rock was worth it. Feels like by rock I mean like freaking fossil. Triple attack? Okay. Let's see. Weak against cold? I think I have Bizarre then. Send sneaky stuff here. Looks like a freaking chimera. It's defense. Let's see what they can do. Is it really not gonna do anything? Death sentence. Chat, is there anything worth trying to learn here? Casting on clouds? I'm, I'm gonna definitely put something on Nanaki. I just forgot to. Death. That sounds, it does sound like a death set. It does sound like something important. Okay. Nice, all right. That was a good pick then between all of those enemies to like pick the sneaky step. To like actually attack. Nice! Picked it up. New skill acquired.
Let's see. So if we take a look at materia. What was Matra Magic again? Oh, non elemental damage to anything. Death Sentence. Pronounces Death Sentence on one opponent. That sounds really cool. I wonder what's. Like, how. What are the conditions for Death Sentence? That sounds like a lot of fun. Okay, now on the key. Let's give you some better equipment first. Mithril Clip is worse. Maybe, maybe you'd benefit from four slots. Trax Chocobos. We're gonna put this sense here, and someone else also has sense. Okay. Yeah, we did get Bigard. I gotta use it in fights. Okay, there's another hole here. A funny looking rock. Break it open. We're gonna suffer every single time I break a big rock, aren't we? Mm, so Aeris up. What was their weakness? Was it ice? No, was it fire? Might have been ice? Let's try Death Sentence out. Ooh, they try the same. They can also cast it. Interesting. Dang, the misses. Don't get cocky. Throw it right back at them. Wait. Why is it that sometimes it can do a death sentence, but like otherwise it just does damage? It's a countdown. Oh, I see the countdown right there. I see that, I see that. These flames shall consume you. Oh, that can be handy for like a bigger enemy. You know what could be a nice combo? Is like... death sentence into like manipulate and then just have them turn around or like frog song or like anything that freezes them and doesn't allow them to act the issue doesn't work on bosses normalized dive way faster so it's kind of awkward not for grinding after 60 seconds i'm waiting for rebirth to be on pc very soon right what was the what was the deadline for it was like six months of exclusivity so like then it's um, March, April, May, June, July, August. So August? We're getting it for PC? So it's not the best then? I think these are all blizzard, blizzard enemies. Oh, I don't think I've used Breath of the Earth before. She's 
she's unfortunately out of mana. For a blizzard attack. I think both of them are poison here. Gives you Dragon's Dogma two time. I hope you're enjoying the game. For me, I have like so many games I want to play anyways. Like I got Elden Ring DLC, got Hellblade, got this, got Rebirth, you know, like. Got a lot to do. Replay the first one. I've been debating that myself. It's like actually worth it. So what I can do is I can head to Aerith here. Swap out. Restore and ice. The magic item. Ether. Magic. Aerith. Cura. Well, maybe even Cura will be enough. That's not as much as I would like on Cloud, but you can at least heal C Cloud individually. Alright, swap that out again. I should just do it in the exchange menu, that would be so much easier. Um, I buy games and only play Elden Ring, so this is why I don't buy games, Morgan. Like, I literally, I know myself. Like, there's so many things that are like, seem so interesting, and then like, I never get time to play it. Um, and then it just sits in my library, it's like, why did I even this pay the $60 price tag for it? So, I just like, I only buy things if I know I'm going to be playing them. What? You mean a rock that didn't result in a fight? That sounded like a switch or something. Activating. What's here? Ho ho ho! The ghosts of the Gi tribe haunt this place. They were all defeated by a certain warrior. A certain warrior? But even in death, the vengeful spirits of the Gi lingered, unable to return to the life stream. We still have much ground to cover. <laughs> Second half of 2025 when Rebirth hits the PC, so we're, we're talking more than six months exclusivity. Yeah, the old man's pretty great. This rock has a peculiar shape. Are these a fire, guys? Happy Friday. Nice to have you. I call upon the Hellfire. Right. I don't think there's anything at the back of these caves. What's this? Can we even interact with it? I'm scared of the death something thing in the back. I'll put you on ice. Yeah, 
in most cases I don't, unless it's kind of like a boss. Seems like it's okay. So, which way am I going? Maybe it really is where the old man was at. Gotta be ready for the Geet tribe. There's a chest here. It's like there's many levels of the space. Yeah, I thought so. Jeez. That looked extremely slippery. Dang, did Era take the blow for that? We might die here. This place is rough. Gotta get a good heal on us. Heals? I just didn't realize there were undead enemies. Magic. Item. No. Why does it keep doing that? Sometimes it just goes one slot too far. Phoenix down, and then magic, Aerith, Cura. So we gotta swap it out for her to be able to do cure all. Nice, this is where we got the material. Add effect material, that's new. Oh my god, it's Sweet Matter! Miss you, you I miss you too. How you been, Sweet Matter? I hope uh, you're kicking life in the butt. As it deserves. These are weak too. It's just bizarre on all of them. Yeah, I'm trying to as well. Like, life is okay, but sometimes I get way too stressed out. Sometimes you just have bad fog days as well, like mental fog days. It's kind of one of those days for me right now, but uh, I'm pushing through. There's just a lot of good people to talk to, to help me with that. This is like freaking Pokemon, like, challenge. Like, how do I go back and slide the other way? Like, does anyone remember that one gym with the ice? So you can slide your way to the gym leader? That's what this thing is reminding me of. Thank you so much for the 34 months as well. Inflict the status effect on hits. Let's give it a look. No, oh, stop it with that. So, someone, well, the thing is, let's see. Nanaki doesn't have it. Someone like Clouds could actually benefit from something like that. But he also doesn't have it. Which means... Aerith... She might also not be able to do it. I don't think anyone here has linked... Uh, unless this one. Which honestly might be better for her to keep on all with ice and stuff. So I might hold off to do that on like Tifa or something like that. Okay, there we go. We actually got through. When did you save last time? Not sure. But there isn't a place to save here. I 
never get jump attacked. Nice, I got the death blow. We're gonna try and be as cautious as we can to make sure that we survive. All right, so this is one way to get this box. Bolt plume. Ooh, now we got the jump on them. Burn. Oh, they're weak against cold. Misread on my part. Okay, where are we going now? There's nothing this way, but there is a little tunnel this way. Shakes me to another item. Oh, an ether. Okay, that's handy. Now we can go up the stairs. I don't think there's anything to the left. There seems to be two paths here. And these are the ones that were weak to fire. Maybe. Oh, that miss. Talk about lower level up. So we probably are going to need to do a cure on the entire party soon. This looks like the way out. And then it looks like there's nothing here. Alright, so that's, that left path is where we're going. Hi Crash! I'm doing fantastic, how about you? Life's good. Um, I will say I'm just a little tired today mentally. So I'm really looking forward to the weekends. Wait, no! That's not what I wanted to do. That's not what I wanted to do. Blizzard on all of them. Wow, 1000 damage on a normal attack. Beautiful crit. Literally everyone incurred poison. Big heal is in order. As you can see, this cave leads to the other side of Cosmo Canyon. The Gi were larger than us and were, above all, merciless. Had they invaded from here, they would have met with very little resistance. <laughs> Let us proceed. Alright. Curious swap out, exchange. <gasps> no, don't remove all. That was a mistake. Not that it really matters, but.
I'm trying to maybe um, substitute one of these the transform on here. Maybe Nanaki, he can equip the new material we just got. Instead of Chocobo, we could put added effect to start leveling that one. Let's do a heal. Did I not put it in conjunction? the heal oh yeah whoops my bad that's the wrong heal there we go Actually, mean to put two ethers on Aerith, but that's okay. Let's see. Swap out this for ice. Yeah, it. Um, when they called him Nanaki, they basically put that as his name title. I didn't realize that they didn't really do that in the actual game. There's several paths here. Okay. Let's see where we end up. It's only one of them. Oh, nice. That went really quickly. <laughs> oh, red. Oh, he has like such cat like behavior. I love it. So, where are we going? That's extremely confusing. Okay, I see, I see. And how do we get to this chest then? Nana in Japanese can mean seven, yet another number seven reference in this game. Kind of interesting considering it is, is Red 13, but I guess that's not the chosen one. Chosen name for Red. I thought it was a spider web. Ah. What do you think of this trick? Stinger level 25. That's a lot of HP, actually. That's actually a ridiculous amount of HP. That missed. Woo! Sting bomb! Dang! That hurt! I think we have death blow on cloud. Okay, hit its mark, nice. That has a scary amount of health. Good thing we dispatched it so quickly, because there's a second one here too. We might never have to cross it though. Go. Come on, Anaki. Get him. Nice. I love the animation where he just pushes it out of the way. Yeah, red kids tend to level up the most between all of us. See, there's still an item here that we can't reach. I'm guessing this is not the right path. Go around. 
around here, and it would also not be the right path. Hey, Madrivor! Happy Friday, how you doing? Hmm. Very hard to navigate this place. Hey, Greg, welcome back. The day's going okay. Fall Fantasy is a welcome distraction. Playing Fall Fantasy is definitely the right path in life. You're doing good. <laughs> Thank you, Zankaroshi. How are you doing as well? Happy Friday. Hi, Rabo. So, we can go through this web again. Did we not encounter a spider this time? No, there it is. Maybe fear will be really good here. I'm gonna death blow. Ooh. You know what? Chocobo versus spider. Send it. Okay, amount of damage. Only that death blow actually hits. Nice, that one did connect. Cure self. Let's use fire. These flames shall purify. The Gambago? Um, our game crashed. Greg, and literally all the gamba was undone for the day. All the progress, but we didn't lose the experiences like that we had together playing it. Burn the spider, legit strats. The warrior ran through this cave alone. There's still some more paths to take here. Fighting the Gi tribe attackers, one after another. Grandpa, who was that warrior? Oh, we're almost there. Yeah, there's still some sections we haven't been to, but I kind of want to move back to the last spider web here. This one might lead to one of these like hidden tunnels. No, nope, doesn't. I hate it when we get a whole like bunch of them like this. I'm gonna use wizard magic on them. What do you think of this trick? <laughs> Secret tunnel. Yeah, I haven't seen any of it. It really didn't want me to gamble at all, Marius. It's like, we'll spare you the time. Proceed on to the main story. Do you prefer random controls, uh, encounters or controlled ones in the new RPGs? I don't mind random at all. I mean, I grew up on games like Pokemon, but sometimes I'd be frustrated. Like, it can be a frustrating element when you're like trying to get somewhere. Oops, I didn't have death was selected. Like, you're trying to get somewhere, and then this encounter comes up, and you're like, Oh, I just want to keep moving forward. Stop. Let me be. I'll help you do this. Good heal. Let's try another death blow. Hopefully this item pays off here. God, how many fights am I gonna get into? Let's use one of our five million potions. 
top up Nanaki a little bit. Okay, here's an item. I don't know what I obtained. I cycled through too fast. Classic. Oh, I totally forgot Boomy was even a character. And Avatar lost Airbender. Here it comes. We are in um oh my god, what's called Cosmos Canyon. Okay, Vaughn. We found out Red's real name. And we saw the history of the planetary like science stuff. The bioscience. Very Quest 11 does random, uh, it does encounters the best. Everything is, uh, the overworld and you can avoid a ton of encounters. I mean, that's why, like, things like Rapala and stuff are, um, part of, like, old Pokemon games and whatnot. Is that, like, in case you really didn't want to. You really could just use items to help you, like, get through the overworld. I haven't ever played Dragon Quest, though, and I would like to at some point in time. You have good news? Yeah, what's that? Josh, tell us the good news. Dragon Twist, Dragon Quest 2, I just finished it. I hear things that are good about 9 and 11. Um, I don't know about any others that might have like come across as well recommended by people. You found Lissano Rave? Okay. <laughs> Do you know what Rave means? You are nothing to me. Yeah, I am fried rice. The OG. Well, we're in the same boat then, Greg. I wonder how I get to those items. I didn't find a path. Uh, it means unseen. So you can kind of like translate it as like the whispers or the words of the unseen. It's a definitely like kind of like a Arabic, uh, Islamic inspired word. What in the world? Grandpa. Is this? They perished, and yet the wow. specters of the Yi linger Reminds here me like, of like stagnant air. Japanese, like this does not bode well for us at all. Omens and demons and stuff. Jeez, that looks scary. Okay, first things first. Sense. We have multiple. We have Gi. Gein attack, and then these soul fires. Wait, is sense not enough to like stop the combat? Oh, it's healing. Holy power. Magic. Cura. Keen attack. Nice. That was actually a heck ton of damage. I don't know if I have. I do have a cura. Keen attack. Restored. Alright, cura. Thing's almost dead. Drain. On Aerith? No. You wouldn't. Did you just take MP from me? Maybe a 
The fear is healing it. I have to get rid of that thing. Okay, that target's dead. Oh, wait, did I actually do enough damage? That was short-lived. I did it! Nice, HP plus upgrade. Do I have an X potion as well? Uh, by the way, I did send this message before. Um, I like many types of food, but since I was a child, I love the recipe for my country, which consists of boiled potatoes sliced and battered. Do you have, does that have a name, Michael? I would love to know. That sounds really good. But they are low accuracy to hit him. That would be such a... It would be cool. Like, he wasn't a hard fight, honestly. Thank you, Cloud. A Phoenix Without Down help, with low accuracy would have, would have been survived. such a waste of my own Phoenix Downs. And Nanaki. It would seem Explosion that you've grown remarkably strong as I have well. to see which ones I have in my inventory, but they feel like such a waste of <laughs> resources. Really like, so. that honestly did not take that long to I kill. Was right. Bringing you here yeah, it is. I understand. Mistake. Come. What I have to show you is just up ahead. Let me show you. Let me see what kind of items I have. So we got... Um, we have two elixirs. Uh, those are so nice to have, though. And we... X potion? We have high potions. We really should use high potions. We've hardly touched them, because, like, potions are, like, the first thing that pop up in the inventory. X potion. And these are so much better. Fully restored HP. Now I'm holding on to those. We're probably gonna need them in disc two, honestly. Gravity materia. Is this the first time we're obtaining gravity materia? No, we might have one on TV. Item in the range? Oh. 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 <laughs> I do the person. Oh. <laughs> I see. I should have thought that there would be an arrange system for items as well, considering... We've done as much for materia as well. <laughs> it has auto settings? Orcas in pain? It'll put like battle items? What if I want to sort it myself? Battle, throw, type, name, mostly. I mean, I like that. I have to say, this is more than some games provide you. Like, think about things like Dark Souls, how long it took before they implemented something like this, right? Or like, just had. I don't even think they ever implemented an auto sort. But then a game like this is like, oh, you know what? How do you want to arrange this, uh, these items? Okay. Thank you for the tips. I appreciate it. Uh, patatas a la importancia. Like, yeah, literally importance potatoes. Uh, I have to look this up. I like making potato dishes. Importantia. Ooh, those look really good. Those look really delicious. Thank you for sharing, Michaela. Appreciate it. All right, let's go to the door. This is... Does dad give his life? The warrior fought against the Gi right here. He kept them from taking even a single step into Cosmo Canyon. Why don't you share this information with him? 
then he never returned to the village again. Behold, Nanaki, the face of the warrior. Seto, your father. Wow. Is that like a statue or a petrification of his father? That, There's like bolts and stuff like that. That's Seto. Seto continued to fight the Gi right here. He never Only someone stopped that's soft. protecting the canyon. Even after the Gi's poisonous arrows turned his body into stone. Even after he had chased them all away, he continued to protect us all. And he still does. Even now? You thought him a coward who had simply run away. But he alone gave his life to protect Cosmo Canyon. This is your father. This is I find Seto. it so weird when they never like this tell is characters Seto? like, yo. Did mother know? You have mit misconceptions about your father. Oh, 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 she knew. At the time, they asked me to seal the cave shut and not tell a soul. They said that the cave should be forgotten about. Yet that kid oh. was super glue was trying to like pry in the ear. My apologies, Cloud. But would you mind leaving the two of us alone? Nanaki, you must continue your journey with Cloud and the others. Grandpa? Listen to me, Nanaki. They say they wish to save the planet. Truthfully, I don't think it can be done. <laughs> For even if they shut down every Marco reactor, it will only postpone the inevitable. Even if they stop Sephiroth, it will all be for naught. All that there is shall perish eventually. But Nanaki, lately I've been thinking. Isn't there something? Anything that we can do as dwellers? No. As part of the planet when it suffers so horribly. Regardless of what happens, shouldn't we at least try? Or are we to sit here and meekly accept our fate? I'm too old to do anything about it now. This year I'll be a hundred and thirty! That is why you must go, Nanaki. You must go in my stead and find out for yourself. <sighs> Grandpa. I wanted to show you the truth about your father before you left. I am so glad you came back while I was still alive. Oh, Grandpa, don't talk like that. If you left me... I... <laughs> I have lived long enough. Grandpa, you have to continue to live for me. But I'll go. I'll find out what's going to happen to the planet. And then come back and tell you everything. Nanaki. I am Nanaki of Cosmo Canyon. The son of the warrior Seto. I'll return a warrior true to that noble name. So please, Grandpa. Dang, materials are just raining down. Those are... Seto's. Oh, Seto. Seto. Fa father That was a wolf owl. Can't tell if cat or wolf.
It's so sad that it's writing material. Should we get moving? So it's goodbye, Red 13. That's just the way it goes. Too bad. He came in real handy at times, didn't he? I kind of want to take um, Kachi for a while. Or Kachi for a while. I don't think I've had them in my party for much. I kind of want to see what I could possibly do with them. Give us one more materia slots. The only problem is I don't really have materia. Yeah, I, I want to see, like, what I could potentially do with them. Mm -hmm. Hi, Mr. Fell, what's up? You sure? Nah. I was thinking of getting something with more slots, honestly. It didn't feel like nearly enough. So where are we going now? Like, I thought Red would come to talk to us. It's safe. Wait, hold on. Um, item, equip... Catchy, so it's a double item. Okay, black microphone. And let's save here. We can go see if we can talk to Grandpa. Like, one more time. And then we can just leave. Maybe he'll only catch up with me on the way out. Like, as I'm leaving in very anime fashion. Red joins with the party. This is so weird. There's such a weird, like... Think about trying to turn this corner. Cloud gets stuck. <laughs> See even here. Nice not. Hey Nautilus, welcome back. Yeah, I would love to see what this looks like in the rebirth. That it'll be incredibly impressive. I think Yuffie was just in one of these kitchens earlier, but we didn't get a chance to talk to her. Let's um go to the end real quick. Where was that end? Is it this way? No, this is not the end. Wait, where is it? Did I already miss it? Oops. It might have been exactly where I was looking at. I just walked right past it. Here. In the back. No? Now I'm extremely confused. Then there's a house at the bottom here. That's an inn. This one. A 
I forgot about the store. Welcome! It's... Get some rest. We're getting so close to bad movie night again. We should be holding our first bad movie night that we've done this year. Um, this Saturday, in case anyone wants to join along. Um, it's not the worst movie in the world, but it was community voted. We're watching Face Off. I've never seen Face Off before. And hopefully we'll be uh, voting for next month's bad movie night next week. So you want to pop points into that? Wait for me. It's 2,000 points too. a day that you can put towards the goal. Huh? Hopefully we'll have a movie lined up for April as well. See? Very anime style. Yeah, I think... I've heard good things about Face Off, but I thought people were gonna choose the Wicker Man. I grew up a little. That's what happened. Come back whenever you're in need of my knowledge. I've never seen Face Off. I have never seen Wicker Man. Both I have never seen. We're back into the overworld. Let's see, where are we in the map? Yeah, there doesn't seem to be much here. Unless we could cross over. seen this our friends like limit before wait how does the roll of the dice work that looks really interesting John Travolta in the cage in the movie by John Woo how could that ever be a bad thing I think it'd probably be okay but it's a good excuse for a movie night and we'll we'll pick something a lot worse next time OG Wicker Man is great. I get surprised. There's some interesting places in the north. We'll be venturing somewhere there. Boop, boop. There was also a path that we haven't taken on our way in. This game is so big. Sense. Deadly needles. Don't you dare put me to sleep, thank you. We can get fire. Tifa actually has fire in her gloves. Oh, that's what I wanted to put on her. So we can just attack. And she does fire damage. Catchy determines... Uh, level determines the number of dice rolled, if I recall correctly. The numbers of the dice determine the damage output. Okay, so how, how do we read it? Like, let's say if it rolls seven, what does that mean? I've never seen this jellyfish enemy in all of your playthroughs, so well. See it now. My run of Dark Ark Souls at Foster's House was so good. Thank you. I appreciate that. I was really proud of that run. It wasn't exactly the best executed run of my life, but uh, it was it was fairly smooth and that's all I could really ask for. So this is all an earth. Um, maybe what I wanted to do is try out... Oh wait, who did I put that on? Exchange. I believe... Nanaki added, just to level it up. Right, add. Add effects. So, you said that add effect adds things like what? Poison? 
but elemental like what's the difference really status and elements so anything that's a status what constitutes as a status hi paul love the green thank you i really appreciate that mr Pearl. i had a great time with that run i would do it again if i could poison sleep slow yeah the element ones make sense i just try to identify some of the ones that are status okay sleep poison yuri petrify silence paralysis darkness frog is a status wait can you put frog on there like transform small hmm Like, can you do transform? To make things a frog? Like, does, does that combination work? try and see if that works hey carl i'm doing okay how about you i'm hanging in there wait what did i remove here ah let's put earth back on long week yeah i'm feeling that too i could really go for the weekend right about now might as well try to see and find out yeah i'm excited that might work. It's been years and I still can't get over how good the Final Fantasy 7 OST is. You know, it's so good. Is it German, by the way? Wickerman is a movie that exists. Yes, it does. I would like to see the original, though, if it's better than the remake. Um, okay, so Kashi's dice limit is X multiplied by Y multiplied by 100, where X is the total rolled and Y on the dice, and Y is the size of the largest group you can roll a double of. You start with two dice and gets additional dice when you reach a 10th level, 30, 40, 50, so on. Okay. All right. We'll see how it works out then. Thank you for the explanation. I really use status effects in JRPGs because there seems to be so much stuff to immune to them when you try using them. Yeah, like things that like bio or poison or whatever doesn't work. Agree. Very atmospheric and cool. I will have to give it a check. Alright, so what do we got here? Got any plans for the weekend, Carl? Dang. I wonder what they were weak to again. Is it cold, I think? Nice. Don't think I have cold. We can swap it out though, if we need to. Let's... Materia... Swap out that... Exchange... From Aerith. Okay. Alright, where are we headed? Oh, I see a gap that we can cross. I see more places we can go to. Look right here. Another town. I don't think I've seen this before. Nibble. Oh, Nibbleheim! No. Nibbleheim! 
let's see what other weeks are. Nibble. Yeah, Nibble? Oh, it worked! I was like, yo, the enemy glitched out. I can't see it, but it became a little froggy. It became a little froggy. Cute. I, I think everyone says Nibble, but it doesn't really matter ultimately. Look at it, the water tower! See, I know this town. Huh? We're back home! But it all burned down! Jeez, unless. Yeah. Then how is this possible? My house is still here, too. That was I was telling the out. truth. I remember the intense heat of the flames. This is such a weird moment, right? Hello, welcome. What's this village went up in flames five years ago? What the hell is going on? <laughs> Please, sir, don't talk such nonsense. I was born and raised in this village. Nothing awful like that has ever and happened you should here. Know who I am? Interesting. So either Cloud's memories are the ones messed up because he's been seeing really weird things since the beginning of the game, or someone's trying to cover something up. I don't know. Something's going on. The heck is a that? man in a black cloak. He has a tattoo. The number six. Hmm. He's holding something. A luck source. Must go reunion. Jeez. But he gave me a luck source. Sources together. More luck on team. Hi, Mr. One. How are you? Happy Friday. <gasps> Did I just save the game chat? Because why does it do that? I don't know which one of the mods is making my game crash. Did I save? I feel like I saved recently, but I don't remember exactly when. Oh, that's okay, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Don't panic, don't panic, don't panic, don't panic! It was like, PANIC! Don't panic! <laughs> yeah, I mean... I honestly, I did so when I was playing something like, um, Baldur's Gate 3, like, just quick saving all the time, but... No, no, it's okay, it's okay. No need to panic, it's fine. Like, we didn't even lose that much progress. Okay, you panic a little bit, it's fine. Just a little bit. I permit it. Yeah, just for not panicking. You can have small panic. Better do 200 HP or damage. Dang, you did more. Nice. Why does this Moogle look like they have a zipper at the back of their... Like, on the rack? 
I think it'd be really cool to see Experience Moon after your Final Fantasy VII experience. That game is a subversion of a lot of RPG tropes. Basically, not by the hero in that game. It's a really beautiful game. I don't think I've ever heard of it. And speaking of that, I've never seen that before. Shell? Got your number! It just used Shell. That's annoying. That's fine, that worked out. Oh, it turned into a tiny little frog. Jump kick, dive kick? Let's see a dive kick. Nice. A wheel frog. Jump kick. <laughs> Xenomorph that's also wearing pants. The longest time it was Japan uh, Japanese exclusive only got released worldwide in the past few years. Maybe that's why I've never heard of it. We'll save before we go to fake Nibelheim. Oh, here it is again. Easy. Well, we don't know. It's just me throwing out words there. I have no idea. I don't really want to, like, get into the speculation just yet. Like... The idea is, like, can we trust Cl Cloud's memories, considering there has been some weird stuff about that? Like, what can we trust and what we ca what can we trust? Only a matter of time until we find out. Hearing this music brings back memories, it also reminds me of random encounter frustration. I haven't had that just huh? yet. But... But I imagine it's probably yeah. gonna get more intense as we proceed discs. I was telling... I remember. Okay, don't mind me. I'm just skipping dialogue because we've already seen this. Cloud's Hello. a poser. What's your? He's not a real boy. This village. What? I was born. Hello. Um. Hello. Welcome. Um. Sorry, they mean to talk to him five million times. A man. He has a tat. What's upstairs? I remember this room. Mm -hmm. Hi, Greg. Good luck with work. Have a nice weekend. This one was Tifa's home, right? No, wait, there's more figures. Union. That's just weird. Union. Union? Isn't that the kids? We remember these. It was one that imitated the other. I remember that. Oh, we keep talking to them, we get something? You. I remember these children, they were in this house. One of them mimicked the other one. like some full metal alchemist kind of stuff right now. Who 
Blue side patch wolf dog star bike. This guy has a tattoo of the number five. Are you also gonna give me a source? Okay. So, Sephiroth's minions. He has the number 11 tattooed on him. Turbo. So, we had 11, 5, and 6. He had the number 1 tattooed on him. Right as a 13. This is Tiva's home. Sephiroth's The stance. tattoo of the number 4. Okay, we got 4, 5, 6. <laughs> One, four, five, six, seven. Thirteen. We take our order war again. Try. Nope, doesn't seem to work. Back then, I definitely played this piano. Why hasn't it burned? Should I play on it? Why not? Now, how did it go? Oh, that's right. Thank you for coming to my performance, my recital. I hope you all enjoyed that piece. There's actually a secret here I never cared to learn. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> hey, Gallantly, what's up? YouTuber Super Eyepatch Wolf? I know him through his video game content, but he mostly talks about anime. Okay, I see. I see. I mean, I honestly think that the constraints are kind of awesome. Like, you get so much creativity out of the constraints of an era of consoles. What about Cloud's house? Oh, what? There's a person Something here? Something the matter? I lived in this house until I was 14. The whole village was burned to the ground. You're dreaming! Get out of here! That's so weird. Hi, Tech! Something the ma- I lived in the- The whole village- You're dream- mm. Interesting. This is really bizarre. Maybe the mansion is still here, the Shinra mansion. Oh, there's no dialogue for her at all. That was weird. Only store merchants have dialogue in this game. Nice village, isn't it? We've been in business here a long time. That's not true. Are you connected with this village? I lived here until I was 14, and I don't remember you. It's not nice to lie. Maybe they're all planted here. Plants. Another one over there. He has a tattoo of the number 12. Okay. So we've got mm. 1, 4, He's 5, 6, something. 11, 12, and 13. Can you hear the voice of Seth? So who are 2 Roth. and 3? I feel like those are the important questions. I'm getting a lot of items. The voices. I really like the PlayStation 2, GameCube, Xbox era soundtracks a lot because they had fidelity to do actual instrumentation instead of MIDI. But having been infected by the virus of American blockbuster style ambient soundscape pieces that have turned so many modern AAA soundtracks into the same need indistinct mush. Agree, agree. I feel that way too. 
Music is perfect for the original by the time the PS2 was released. Games pretty much had normal music, not having to compromise anymore, yeah. It's just, it's like, you will never get things like this unless people want to go back to the, the classics. Like now, people do it out of a sense of nostalgia, or like trying to experiment with a medium they never tried out themselves. But even though they have ability to incorporate so much more these days. So it's like, this is just unique. Product of his time. Western RPGs in general tend to have more ambient orchestral soundtracks. Japanese RPGs are more varied, catchier. There's a lot of bops oh, RPGs for calling. sure. Calling. Zephyroth is calling. Ugh. Okay, no number on this one. Maxine! Thank you. Great. I added Sephiroth the green in there too. Is near inside the mansion. That one that was wheezing in like Tifa's house, that was truly really scary. I wonder if I can go this way if it's blocked. Oh you oh you just go out from the other side of the Canyon Mountain. Tiverde, enjoy the lurk. See, this is something that blew me away. Oh, now the gate won't close again. The symbol on the gate seems to be the symbol of the Final Fantasy logo. Let's look through all the rooms. All right, this shows you how to play music. I'm not doing another recital though. Oh wait, there's encounters here this time? Oh, interesting enemy. Get, wait, Garofelgo? Weak against gravity. Well... Frog. Put sleep. We do have Korra. Standing my ground! Oh, it missed? That's a shame. So many misses. Hey, rats! Let's turn it up. Oh, this keeps missing. Wait, maybe this is the ground magic. Okay, so I have to probably cast it through the form of an item. Thank you, Rad. I don't have anything prepared yet, but it's taco night. Um, I do have some like little leftovers, like Japanese curry, if I want to snack on something. But soon I'll probably be heading off to make some dinner. Um, but it's so nice to see you, Rad. Please enjoy the weekend, and thank you for the 45 months. I'm not a musician myself, but I learned something I learned about music when I was young is that it limits uh, limits often foster creativity. I agree. That, that's why I enjoy it so much. I enjoy the limitations. Um... Here. Gravity ball. A whole week off? Hell yeah, what are you gonna do? It doesn't do as much damage as I would hope. Ooh, they're grounded now. Nice. Oh wait, never mind. It did enough. Tifa's close to a level up. I, I think it's so cool that the second time you come around to this house, like literally, um, you get random encounters. I think it's, it's awesome. Hmm. Twin Viper, what is Twin Viper? Oh, nice! We found a new weapon for Yuffie. Let's get to that room. <laughs> Looks like uh, it's a boys' weekend as the wives are out of town. Time for debauchery, and by that I mean most likely beer and video games. Hey, everyone enjoys that. 
That's like a really good way to spend your off time. I hope you have a great time, Gal. Like, what are you? What are you gonna be playing? What games? As little as possible. Um, also, I'm obligated to celebrate my birthday with fam early next week. Oh, I can't believe it's been another year, Rad. Rad, are you gonna let me wish you a happy birthday? You have to come by so I can wish you a happy birthday. Oh my god. Just ask them to do things you actually want, Rad. Like, I don't know, get you a steak. Oh, uh, I, I don't know what you want, Rad. What do you want? Like, you want video games? You want collector's items? You want a steak? You want beer? What do you want? Ask them. You want, like, the tiniest, like, chocolate cupcakes you've ever seen in your entire life? You're streaming Tuesday. I will be streaming Tuesday. They're called Dorky Face. It's like you, Rad. You checked the new weapon for Tifa you got? I thought I did. So, like, when did I get a new weapon? <laughs> Hold on, let me hit one. What can you tell me about Dorky Face? Level 23. 520 uh, HP. Funny breath. Let's see if we can steal that. Aw, oh, miss. Couldn't manipulate. Curses, huh? They silenced me. Is that maybe the first instance I've seen silence, or maybe like the second? Let me see if I have anything for that. After I try manipulating one of these. Oh, I finally got manipulation. Got nice, nice, nice. Cure silence. Oh yeah, echo screen. Okay, cool. We need more of those though. Teach us something. Cloud. That didn't teach us anything. How about funny breath? Oh, wow! That made them attack each other! That's not good. Oh, no. Let's just kill it. It's a frog now! I love Dorky Base. I did a shit drawing, or shitty drawing of them around Halloween this year. They're so cute. I love, like, I know that I always talk about how, like, um, sometimes Pokemon are, like, the most uninspirational designs ever, but, like, I have a thing for all the like the psychic ghost like weird like halloween pumpkin types i don't know why i just really love those ones but i can't care for ones that look like keys you know but these ones so good Let's do something. Oh, I turned myself into a frog. That sound! Heal. Nice, Phoenix down. Silver M phone. Hey, we're getting some definitely some uh 
items for our party, so... Oh, look at that! Look at all these slots now I get. So if I wanted that with uh, Kashi, I literally have now something with had like a million material slots, kind of like Aerith has. That's good. And Tifa? Platinum Fist. Literally none of these are improvements. Go into item high potion. I always make that mistake. Like sometimes double using an item twice on one character when I don't mean to. All right, I remember the right being the layer, but we're gonna go left first. Oh, not this guy again. Wait, there's someone that uses gravity. Well, they're not on the grounds. Um... Shake What did he say? Nice, Tifa. Shake weights? Okay. Shrink ray? That could also be it. Yeah, it needs to be singing Wrecking Ball. Definitely, Morgan. <laughs> it's really funny. No, nay, exactly. <laughs> no idea, Gorka. Let's see what we got here. I have a bad feeling about this. Open the safe anyway. Um. Uh. Wait, what? I can. I can. Break the combination of the lock? Chat, I need assistance. What do I do? This place is so cool. I'm gonna sense one of these things. That has a lot of HP, what the? This is so confusing. It's because I used a funny breath on me and then I started acting weird. Stop! Hi, Louie! Thank you for the 56 months! How you doing? Get him. No! Get him! How are you doing, Louie? Happy Friday! Okay, so we can go down. He said near the entrance. Hi, Torty! Happy Friday to you, too. Here? I must rid myself oh, of all Hojo. those who interfere with my research. That man from the Turks is no exception. I have made some somatological improvements to his body and put him to sleep in the basement. Look for him there if you're interested. You do this, what? however, nothing more than a capricious game I have created. Do not feel obliged to take part. Move the dial on the safe carefully, but quickly. You have 20 seconds. The hints for the dials are... The lid of the box with the most oxygen. The lid of the box with the most oxygen? 
Uh, okay. Oh my god, Morgan! Morgan, thank you so much for the support. I appreciate it. Thank you so much for becoming a supporter on YouTube. I appreciate that so much. Hey, you have access to at least uh, a bunch of the emotes that also um, people on my Twitch channel have. I'm thinking about uploading more because I put a bunch of them on YouTube recently. Um, but the first two are kind of my favorite. The first three, actually. They're really, really good. Thank you, thank you so much, Morgan. I appreciate it so much. I hope you enjoyed the emotes. Thank you for being here. Was that clear? The, the, what lid with oxygen? What would they mean? I haven't seen any oxygen. I'm so confused by this. I must rid my. I have made this. Ha Move the dialogue. Yes, what's the other dial? Behind the one with the black and white. Okay, teeth. this I get. That's a piano. All right. We understand piano. I must rid myself of all those who interfere. I have made this, however. Move the dial on the sink. 40. Di dial from the creek in the floor next to the chair. Move five steps left. Nine steps up. Two steps left. Here Six comes the steps train. up. Oh my god. What are you all doing? Why are you all being so nice? What the heck? Look at that. Jeez. That's so sweet. Thank you so much. <gasps> Tori, thank you for five gifted subs. And Rat, thank you for ten. Oh my god, thank you so much for spreading the love. That's so sweet of you. Aww. I appreciate it so much. You're all spoiling me rotten. I need to- I need to see- hold on, I need to check something really quickly. It's spoiling me rotten right now. Thank you so much for all the support. I'm sure a lot of people are gonna get some great emotes. I don't know about everyone else, but I'm entirely superficial. I just like giving pretty girls money. <laughs> Thanks, Rad. Thanks for the compliment, the concealed compliments. Very, very sweet. Now, now I'm flustered. I need to actually take notes. I need like, chat. I know, it's so sweet, Crash. It's so, so sweet. Um. I must rid my, I have made this. Hold on. Move the dot. We need to, we need to write this down, from chat. The creek in the floor next to the chair. Five Move left. Five steps left. Nine up. Nine steps up. Two steps Two left. left. Six steps up. Six up. Okay, so let's first... Hey, Pac. Let's first find the piano. Would they say it was like behind the piano? Ah, there's so many of them. Heck. I need a summon. I need something that will obliterate them. Alright. Ifrit, do your job. I prefer when pretty girls give me money. Absolutely fair. Become a service dog? She just needs to learn how to control herself? Aww. Susan. Once the vet told us the dog was in the heat, reserved a date to spay her. Oh, I hope it goes well. Literally, um, Torty went through the same by the castration with this dog. I like giving to the less fortunate. Thanks, Torty. <laughs> I love that I had to read it <laughs> after Raz's message. Dang, Torty. So what do I need to do? Is there supposed to be a clue here? Oh, there. Something is written on the floor. Left ten. All right. Okay. 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 
Left, 10. That's the second code. All right, we need the first one. We need the first one. All right, so there's a chair with a creek? I don't know if I've seen that. At least not yet. I really don't like first breath at all. Feel the heat. Please don't burn my friends. Oh. No, stop attacking each other. This is chaos. No, they're killing each other. They're killing each other. That would have been pretty bad if I tried to do death flow and like literally Cloud attacked someone else. You watching? I'm watching. I'm watching Tifa. God, we're missing like hell. Die, please. Thank you. Oh. Da, da, da. All right, let's heal all cloud high potion. Okay, so we're looking for a chair with a creek. And something with oxygen. Oh my god. Oh my god, Fox! We name it Custard. I figured it out, it's Custard Fox. Thank you so much for the 45 months. Welcome back! How are you doing? I can't believe it's the fifth one, jeez. Really productive. Hi, Aru! Welcome in! I'm gonna... I was gonna manipulate one of them and I didn't do any of that. Oh my god, Aru, you gave us up to pub time! What the heck? You're all spoiling you me today. It. Thank you so much for the support. Can we do a swall time test? Oh, nice. Chris Breath actually missed on all of us. We wanna see if we get a um, one of my emotes for swall time. Nope, nope, we gotta try again. Mm, no luck that time either. Tuvia has such good RNG. Your strawberry you guys keep coming up every single time. Lucky gal. Can we save here at all? We cannot. Oxygen. The lid with the most oxygen. We're lost. We're very lost. We're trying to find a clue to open up a safe. Oh, stop with the funny breath. Nice. Just shy of killing it, too. They're actually really frustrating. You're killing them! Look at them just spinning out of control. You're killing them! Yeah. 
so I guess we can try upstairs. That's new. I haven't seen these ones before. Jersey B. What are we looking at here? Not that much HP. What was that? Just blow him up. Shiv out, just blow him up. I don't even care. Have an enemy skill? It looks like it. I want to use manipulation, but... Oh, they took no damage. Stop it, you. Oh my god. I guess they don't take elemental damage. Oh, they do only take elemental damage, but fire? Because Tifa is the only one that could lay a hand on them. That's likely it. I can try um, Thunder. No. Let's defend. Come on, Cloud, you can do it. Manipulate it, come on! No plans at all. Twenty. Rest. Those are my plans. I'm trying to just manipulate one. Come on, just work. Why am I so unlucky? What's happening? Okay, it's the scales. I think it's it tells you about... Hmm, I think I understand. We need to actually do magic on them now. Burn. Based on which way their scale is tipped. Manipulate them now. Nope. We'll just wait. We'll keep trying. We'll keep trying. What's the worst that could happen? I wonder though if we need to attack it to prompt it to tip the scales. Okay, it used Fira now. I'm not getting a manipulation at all. I think you can't manipulate it. I think it has to cast something against us. That actually allows it. Allows us to copy the attack. It might be, yeah. I asked someone about this once. I was like, well, how does manipulate work? If I get can't manipulate, is it that it can't be manipulated and it's immune to it? Or is it that it didn't work, you know? You already got the skill? Really? Did I... Get... Oh, because they did cast it on Cloud multiple times. Alright, let's see. Magic. Enemy skill. Yeah, you're right. Does damage equal to the user's max HP? <gasps> Ooh, hi, Everay. That's cool. I'm so glad Cloud didn't die. We use so many potions in this house. Something is carved on the back of the lid. Something is carved on the back of the lid. Okay, right 36. Right 36. Left 10. And we still need to go find the creaky chair now. All right, chat. Last code. I don't think there's a creaky chair here. Okay. 
I'm gonna use a summon and hack these enemies. Finish it! Bye, Mikola! Get some food for mid noon lunch, practice piano a bit. Oh, I didn't even play the piano, that's awesome. Have a great time. Have a great day. A nice week, and I'll see you next week, hopefully. Alright. Yeah, just burn them. They're so annoying with their cursed breath. Whatever it takes to decimate them. Oh, that's it. That's, that's the chair. They said to the left of it or something? Oh, we need to take paces. Right. So we need to go... How do we do this? One, two, three, four, five. One, two. One, two, three, four, five, six. Child, how does this work? I don't get it. Was it like to the left of the chair? That's... How do you go... Wait. One, two, three, four, five. Weird that it just drops to the ground like that. Hmm. Any help about this one? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two. One, two. Oh. Well, that's not what I want to do. Make Cloud walk normally and count his steps. Okay, but from where? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Just run and spam and track? That's better advice. <laughs> I like that advice. A thing in the back needs to die. That's it. Now I'm angry. No, oh, I love Catchy so much. I guess like I don't know where I need to be in relation to the chair is what's confusing me. Tifa got a level up. Ooh, a mirror. What is a mirror? Reflect on all allies. Something is scratched on the floor. 59. Okay. We got it. Now we can go unlock. It's safe. Summon time. Get rid of them. Smoke them. Smoke them. I don't ever want to see them again. some phoenix down so she's really nice i would save before doing the lock i don't know where to save is there a place for me to save one more code but it says dial one two and three
Oh, you're cool. You have a motorbike? Traveled Italy by motorbike? That sounds real cool. I didn't say anything about that. I thoughts. must read. I have made this. Move the dial on the sick. Dial. Dial 4 has been revealed. Oh. 97? I didn't think that you would just look at the fourth option. I must re I have How made concealed. This. Move the dial. Dial. For dial 4 has been revealed. Oh, that's right, 97. You know, when they say things like right and left, I'm thinking of like conventional like locks and like how you turn them left and right to unlock them, but I don't know if the system has something like this. More summon times! Heck, I wasn't the first one to go. That miss. The status effect of um, having add effects of the frog or mini on like enemies hasn't been too frequent. I thought it would apply a little bit more, but it seems to be pretty variable. More of them. There's four this time. Smoke him! Smoke him! More often when it's a higher level, hopefully it's leveling up a decent amount now. Oh really? Did it not work? I'm annoyed. I'm really annoyed. Oh, that one turned into a frog. Hell yeah. I'm getting bodied. Oh, that one also turned into a frog. Cute. Itself that time. Nice. Level 37. That's good. Two Phoenix downs from that fight. All right. I have, have a something. bad feeling. Of Open. All right. So 36. I don't know if we can do this in time. And then um, left 10. I think I'm doing this wrong. There's no enough time to do this. I have a bad feeling. Why do I need to subtract? I have a bad feel. I don't get it. I did the exact code. Quick and accurate. I am being accurate. Oh, it's because you passed them? How do you do that? But this thing is so sensitive. It's like impossible not to like go fly past it. Like actually impossible. I have a bad feeling about Oh no. Oh my god, that's so annoying. Maybe I can try keyboard inputs. 
Hi, I Julio. Thank you so much for the raids. How is your stream? I'm doing this incredibly hard. Can you actually? Okay, you could do it. Okay, this seems a little bit more precise. Okay, I'll, I'll try again with my keyboard. I have a bad. Oh, went over. Like, it's so sensitive. Is designed for D-pad? Playing Dark Souls 2, I have many gray hairs. I'm sorry. How far did you get, Julio? I hope you at least had a little bit of fun. Thank you so much for the love. I have a bad... like oh i'm losing time i'm like trying to do it slowly so i don't mess up i like quit out oh do i have to press okay maybe that's what i didn't do as well i didn't press like oh i can f oh yeah i have a bad f i wasn't confirming the numbers either I have a bad- Hojo, what the frick is this? This is really annoying. Oh. Cause I'm trying to do it fast and really there's not enough time to do this. survive? Do you see my health? Get them. Get them. Death blow. Miss. I see it too. 6,000 HP. Summon. Death blow. Death blow is the only thing gonna get me through it. How did I freeze it, by the way, chat? I don't know how that happens. Paralyzed status? But how? How did it get paralyzed status? Oh! Really? What are the chances? Oh, I've never had that happen before. 
That's so cool. You're telling me I summoned my Moogle Chocobo summon? And it has a chance of stopping? And it actually applied in a pinch? That's wild. That's freaking good. That's like the kind of magic you need. It's a low chance. Yeah, I needed that. Dang, that was awesome. Learn limit skill Cosmo memory. Who learns this? Anyone? Yeah, that's never happened before. Anyone can learn Cosmo? Obtain Odin. Oh, a new summon. Nice. That was awesome. Put Odin here. We lose some max HP, but we get magic, magic defense, and max MP. Luxat does help on Tifa. I only have that on Tifa. So, can I just use the... Um, <clears throat> the limit break on anyone, chat? That could be rather tough. It looked tough. I don't know how I was going to survive that because like one hit was like 200 something damage for me. The limit break is for Nanaki, really? So I got put Nanaki in my um, party here. For certain characters, I had never seen that before. That's pretty cool. Oh, it didn't work. Oh, and then you can use a specific item. Hmm. Well, we need to then work on Nanaki quite a bit for this. Um, let me just hold on. I want to get Hachi back in here. And then we're going to use our tent. Then we can reach us. Well, I kind of want to work on Nanaki stuff, but. Maybe we can work on leveling them in the overworld. Let's see. I've had luck where, you know, in, in such good situations and no luck in like some really bad stuff. Did I get the basement key? I did not. Did I? I got the Cosmos limit. I didn't see a key. Maybe it's a key item. I don't. I guess it's still there then. It is a lot of XP, but that's okay. If we need to farm, then we can do it. We've collected a lot of Gildas. Uh, time. We lost all of our progress at the gold saucer because the game decided to crash and say no gamba for you. Um, and we went to finish off Gunga Gongaga. Um, we went to, uh, what's it called for the first time? The Cosmos Canyon. And now we found Nibelheim, which is a very strange co event for us. And now exploring the mansion to see who lies beneath. They say Sephiroth is here. I know I saw a little key in the safe. I wasn't sure if you picked it up or not, or something you pick it up. Maybe uh, I will check that out. Wait, I appreciate you pointing it out. Um, what I'm gonna do though, chat, I'm sorry, this is like gonna be, everyone's gonna be like, oh, it's such a bad time. It just happens to be like very close to dinner time for me. Um, and 
This might be a good time as any to just call her for the day and then continue the playthrough next week when we, ha when we stream again. So normally I'm off the weekends, uh, Saturday and Sunday. I might do a Saturday stream, uncertain, but I appreciate everyone that's been hanging out with me, whether it's been on Twitch today or YouTube, um, for all the lurks, the chats, the good vibes. Um, and the good times this week. I appreciate it. Thank you for the gifted subs and the raids and the follows and the lurks and everything. You've all been so awesome. Um, making your mornings fun. Morgan, I hope you have a great rest of your day. That, that means a lot to me. I hope your husky keeps you really warm today. Thanks for pushing me through your week. We did it together. I was having a hard time pushing through my days. So thanks, thanks everyone. I appreciate it everything made it so much easier otherwise i might have been big depresso energy all day on my own um so let's find someone to raid and then i'll see you all next week i'll see you for some final fantasy streams i'll see you for some dark souls runs and whatever it is we get up to but there's a lot of final fantasy on the docket for next week i i really want to now like i'm i'm looking at all these areas like cosmos canyon and i'm like what's this gonna look like in rebirth and so I really just want to like play through this game, enjoy it, take my time with it, but also like finish it up fast so I could play Crisis Core and get into Rebirth. Um, I don't know, just like both excited, but I want to like savor the experience. Hopefully, we also do some gold saucer gambling again because um, losing all that progress today was not fun. I forgot Rise of the Ronin also comes out today. So many games. It's okay. I'm sure. I'm sure I'll feel be better. Thanks, everyone. Raid stream, whatever. <laughs> um, who is on? Who do I want to go to? Hello. Hey. Are you done streaming? Oh, okay. I didn't realize you finished streaming. Give me a second. I can't hear you entirely. Let's go to. Everyone's playing Dragon's Dogma? Mmm, everyone's playing Dragon's Dogma. You just raided Nova? I was just gonna raid her too. L I'm gonna do back-to-back -back raid. Okay. I'm gonna throw you Nova's way, okay? She's a great person. You'll have a great time. I actually was hoping that she would be streaming today so I could watch her during my morning. Um, oh, that's like the wrong window. I have no idea why it's doing that one. There. This is Nova, okay? I was actually hoping to watch her because she gets me through my mornings. Um, and maybe I'll be able to take you somewhere where you can have a good time. Um, she'll she'll take care of you. If you're on YouTube, I guess like if you wanted to, you could make your way over to Twitch or you know, just have a good day. Up to you. Let's do that back-to-back -back raid. She is playing though, Dragon's Dogma. I'm sorry, a lot of people are playing Dragon's Dogma. So if that's a spoiler territory, I get it. Just go say hello, drop out, I get it. Oh, she just literally went on a break. Doesn't matter. We'll flutter anyways. Send her. Let's see. This is the raid message, okay? The emote is like my ham, oh, by the way. That's kind of what it looks like. All right, this is this is what we're gonna send to Nova. Um, go hang out with her, okay? Yeah. See you next time. Have a great weekend. Bye everyone. another mage. Ash, thank you so much for the raid! Ooh, I'll, I'll t hello, we're here to take care of you. Look, look at 
Uh, this, this is my pawn, Mommy Milk. You can't really see her, though. Thank you so much for the follow. Ash, how was your stream? I'm trying to figure out which pawn to hire. I'll show you Mommy Milk in a second. Okay, we're just gonna hire a random. Hello, everyone. We're trying out, uh, we're gonna hire this person. A grand adventure awaits us. Just know it. Sure. Let us work together to honor the honor. Okay, how do I leave? Leave the rift. Ooh, played some Final Fantasy VII OG. Nice. Yes, look at look at Mommy Milk. Oh my god, look at her ready. That's okay. I just wanted to look at you. But hello, welcome on in everybody. We're trying I've never played a Dragon's Dogma game, so we're trying it out for the first time, so I'm a little confused, so you know. We just wanted to hire Yes, we have to go to that guy. Oh, perfect! You're a nose! Perfect! Yeah, we're confused uh, by what's going on, so we're getting the hang of it. But I hope you had a good stream. Uh, I actually really love Final Fantasy 7 OG. So I hope you had a good time, and I know how it is once you're tired and had a long stream, so I won't... I won't ask too many questions. Maybe I should. Oh, that sounds so good, Ash! I had some earlier. Well, I had like a burrito, but... You know, same thing. How did you get yourself in game? I tried to make. Oh shit. Oh gosh, it's harpies. Are these harpies? Okay, how do I shoot again? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. How do I aim this thing? Thank you for the lurk, Ash, and thank you again for the raid. Okay. Okay, where are the harpies? Oh, there you are. I kind of wish I was an archer chat. Holy shit. I can't hit anything. Yeah, I don't know how to aim fox, okay? I'm doing my best. We have reached out to Mommy's level three. Is my sensitivity too high? Bro, no, okay, look. When I move my mouse, this is, this is how much it moves. Are you the- is this the person I was supposed to save? I enjoy tackling fierce foes. No. And prefer combat Bro, I'm trying, okay. I am confident in you and may act independently. Oh, no thank you. I'm trying to save someone here. Are you? Okay, I think I found them. Is that all of them? Yes, you're welcome. Where are my clothes? Can I have cooler clothes? Want to lead, then you can tell me where we're going, and then I will 
follow it. Oh, Jesus, I'm out of breath. Holy shit. Oh gosh, Mira and freaking what's her face have the same haircut. Oh god. That's okay. We should all change our hair to look like that. That looks promising. What Any does? As to how we might reach it? What looks promising? What looks promising, Mira? Dude, they keep saying so many things and it's just confusing me. I would have preferred not to have to work so soon. I hope there's no friendly fire. Come here. Machine with my magic missile. Chat, how do I get Mira back? <laughs> oh, damn, you hate to see it. Mira, no! Well. Ooh. Okay, now we have another quest. Well, that's what she gets for telling me what to do. Okay, so now, how do I look at my quest log? <laughs> quest list. Okay, we have... Is this the main one? Riz? No, I didn't spend 12 hours creating one character. I spent 12 hours creating like five, four characters. Thank you so much for the 33 months. And it was only like eight hours. Oh, thank you. What is this? Do you really know camping kit? Uh, and they can pitch their tent by... Much like staying in an inn in the town, resting at campsites restores the party's health and stamina. Recovers, loss... Adventurers who seldom return to town should keep their camping kit in their packs. Ooh, I don't have a camping kit. Thanks, Squadron. I want to change how she looks. I want to change how she looks, but... Yeah, I made, like, four characters. The first one, uh, chat told me it looked kind of like Brie instead of me, so we started over. Thank you so much for the follow! And then the second one, we were, this one, we were trying to make it look like me. And then we made a pawn... Um, which is mommy milk, and then we made another pawn that was like a cat, sad cat. So yeah. listen to me or you guys are gonna have an accident just like Mira. Now we go.
22 months. I can't help it. Go ahead, Swickles. Go ahead. I'll throw all the pawns off the cliffs. Fact of the stream. These nuts is an expression used to deliberately interrupt or divert a conversation. It is not a literal reference to test mm -hmm. nuts. Rather, it is used figuratively to disrupt and show disrespect mm -hmm. to whatever discussion is currently occurring. The first known usage of Deep's Nuts comes from The Chronic, a 1992 album by Dr. Dre. The actual track is spelled Deep's Nuts. Mm -hmm. The song begins with a phone call between a man and a woman. After a short back and forth between the mm -hmm. Squadron, thank you so much for the 100 biddies. Appreciate that. You'll hurt yourself one of these days. See, I like these two. Nero was just being too demanding, okay? She was like, follow me, follow me! Oh god, mommy, help. Thank you. I don't know what you're doing, but thanks! Hey, old friend. Many thanks for hanging in the No problem. Do I get money? I gotta go to the inn. Okay, chat, we gotta go find another pawn real fast. Welcome back, Minos. Who is mommy? That's my pawn that I made. She, she's my follower. Mommy Mill. Can we have an old man pawn? I can see if I can find one. We need an archer. There's Lucy. Wait, why does she look like, why does she have a cool fit? Revelia. Revel. Re she looks cool. We might have, we might make, she looks cool, okay. I want an archer. Too many mages. Oh my god, everyone's a freaking mage. Is her name just Main Pawn? Okay. No, I'm looking for archers! I only see two archers so far. I'm not only hiring female pawns. I just don't see any archers. Why not farter? Farter? Fighter? Because mommy's a fighter. Oh, there are only... Yeah, yeah, it's true. Are you graded? Yes. Can you filter? Uh... Um, search for pawn. <laughs> Rip Mira. Um, oh, okay. We want a an archer. There's Sarah. Aria. Okay.
have already okay you are how do i see her like is she kind-hearted okay sarah you're hired i'm attentive and loyal and prefer to remain by your side in battle i shall follow your lead and prioritize the wait isn't that just like the other girl though Hired Pearl. All right, let's go do stuff. <laughs> no frenzy. <laughs> Leave the room. Okay. Good for Shall we see if they need to be found while we're here? Yeah, right. Why is Pearl ordering me around? Pearl, listen, I'm not afraid to hire another pawn, okay? Oh. Hi, Marcus. Oi. Oi. Uh, yes. This. I have a delivery. Oi. Pearl might have a little accident in the lake. Actually, like they—they're actually gonna cause like a pause while he's reading it. I forgot I 